that's working good again. Good afternoon, soldiers. Sergeant Fury here. Hell yeah. Rocking on the PS4 for our second session. El Perfecto. This will be tweaking the keys a little bit so we get our keys totally tweaked to where they, you know, we have all the keys the way we want. Then I'll upload this to this company's website. So that way all you lefties that are playing the Division 2 can rock this with the same key set I'm using for the most part. Or adjust it a little bit to your desire. But that's what we're doing. Furnace is up and running. Had to get a new jet. Yeah, man, the jet was all plugged up. I put that sucker in there, man. It was like kicked up to where it's like blinding, where you can't look inside, where it's, that's how it should be. It's burning real efficient. It's probably wasting fuel before, too. We're rocking it, man. That's all I can say. So now, since I'm a level two, I'm going to go ahead and sell off this crap that I was farming everywhere, right? And then we'll work our way over to the theater and keep doing our missions and shit like we're supposed to be doing. How's that sound? Sound like a plan? Sounds like a plan to me. That's all I can say. Now I'm tickled pink, man. I got this shit running. This is like a really good thing, because like I said, now I have faith I can get the, the, the Xbox going. Right? So, get one of them going, get them both going. So I look at it. That's my Keef, my Keef box, in case you, somebody asked me earlier what that noise was, what I was doing, so no, it's my flower box, you guys know what a Keef, Keef box is, it's a Keef box, so, there we go, man, we're going to be rocking this thing. So what we got to do is, I, it's like amazing how, I just can't believe I'm doing this first off. I just told totally a trip. And I, well, I was going to look at my gear first. So that's why I'm going to get all the shortcut keys on my keyboard that you can press like the I key for your inventory. You know, and open up your inventory, all that crap directly instead of going through uh, extra steps. So little by little, be picking people's brains as to the other keys that I might need uh, off of your controller. Because right now, this is the only way I know how to get into my... Well, there's a couple ways, but this is the fastest way to get into my inventory. It's this way. I think that's one. So that one I can mark as junk. Which is L2 and R... See, L2 is marked as junk and R2. So I don't even think I got L2 and R2. I don't know if I have those marked yet. <laughs> you know, if I have those assigned. Let's see, if not, then we'll just Alt-Tab out and we'll assign them. That makes sense. Yeah, cause so once I get it to where like every key you can do everything in here just by pressing a key on a keyboard then I can set this thing up for these guys because the problem is most people are doing the opposite most people are just doing configs for controllers that's why there's no keyboard config according to the manager one of the managers from the company because I said well I downloaded these things and there wasn't anything there he goes, oh, that's because people just use their controllers on the PC to play, and they're sharing their controller setup. So I'm like, ah, okay. I said, well, then I guess I'll have to do the same thing. 
so yeah so we'll have to figure out the uh, l2 and r2 what keys i have for those eventually i'll remember all this shit too obviously that's the other problem is, is sarge remembering everything that i have to remember if that makes sense like i think this might be this key no Yeah, see the um, L2. I have to figure out which key is my L2. Could have swore it was this one. Nope, see, that's not it. That goes on my apparel. Mm -hmm. We already got two masks already. How could that possibly be? Oh, cool. What are you rocking? Some crazy looking masks that I don't want. <laughs> but I don't know if that's a good thing or not. Oh, we got 10 of these badges already. Nice. Oh, I could do my Phoenix one. This is from 2018. Oh, my ghost patch. Oh, we got our charms. Oh yeah, you know we're rocking the American flag. Hell yeah. Well, that's, a, that's, not, that's a gimme. Oh, we got a chest so we can open up or something. Oh my God, look at all these apparel. We got three of those and eight of those that we can open up. We'll do that later when we get a crowd. We don't have a crowd right now, so we'll wait. We'll wait on that stuff. If you guys don't mind. Is it okay? We got our shit. Make sure we got the best, the best stuff on that we need to have on. Yeah, three seventy. Do we want to open these caches now or what? Or do we want to wait? These are only level one, so I guess it doesn't matter, huh? shit we can sell off though that's cool so that'll work what else do we get we 
champions who want to be able to mark this stuff. Mark. L2. these options going on here. Well, I'll figure this out. That's not it. I forgot which one my L2 and R2 are again. I thought that was it. And then I thought these were them. Oh, that's not it. Yes, it does. I'm just marking stuff right now learning you know marking figure out more keys for marking that's all yeah if that makes sense but yeah i'm already at the white house bro i already made it to the white house with a keyboard and mouse all that I did all this shit already. I'm over here now just trying to buy myself better gear. Can I help you find? And but I gotta sell shit first. Yeah, I'm basically setting up, you know, setting up getting rid of stuff and I was looking for one of those. Just what I needed. This is why you want to farm all this shit when before you get to the White House. So you can sell it all and you can upgrade your gear before you leave. I can definitely use this. You know, a lot of this crap you're not gonna use. I was looking for one of those. Just what I needed. All right, now we can arm ourselves here correctly, right? But see, I know where to get weapons at right off the bat, so it's more important to get some better gear, if that makes sense. And you want critical hit damage is better to have. As far as best. You know, but we need both of these. We're going to get both of these right now. If I can get them both. But guns, you can get guns right across the street from the White House. There should be a couple spots we can get guns and gear, but... Okay, I want to buy and equip. So, which one is my triangle again? Oh, God damn it. I don't know which fucking keys they are. with you again. Oh, god damn it. Nice doing business with you. Well, I don't know if I even bought something, dude. I think I did. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so once I get my keys all down, then I'll be like rocking. It. Agent in need of backup. 
so. That'll take me just a, a little bit of time to do, but one thing, you know, like I said, I'll get it all figured out. I'm gonna have to write down a cheat sheet so I can I can remember what they are. I'm just trying to remember which one is my uh, diamond. I can just do it this way. With a triangle, I mean, which one is my triangle key? Oh, number one. All right, go. Cool. So basically, I'm on the PC, but I'm playing on Xbox. I mean, I'm playing on PlayStation. If that makes sense. Okay, so number one key. Thank you for shopping. There you go. Cool. All right, so that worked. Glad we got that settled. Me too. And those. Oh yeah, I'm, uh, Epic Wolf. I'm gonna do that. You know, and that way I can learn learn them all, and then you know. But I'm not doing too damn bad. You gotta admit, I'm doing pretty good so far. So, and what you wanna do over here is get your your drone. You know, it's like the first skill that you wanna get going is your drone, like for sure. Goddess of Pluto. Oh, okay. Cool, man. So, yeah, so that's not going to be an issue. Like I said, you know, little by little, we'll get it all tweaked here. Most important thing is that we got it going that we're sitting on PC playing on a freaking PlayStation, which is like insane, right? I mean, the whole concept of, of that is totally crazy. To begin with, the only thing I'd like to see Ubisoft do is let you carry all your characters and equipment and stats across all the different platforms. Since everything is saved on a cloud server and you have to log in with exactly the same Ubisoft account. So when I logged in, I had to log in with my USA Sergeant Nick Fury and all that crap so they knew who I was. So at that point, they should just let you have your shit if you're on another platform. The whole fact that you get punished and have to start all over again is ridiculous. That's I, That makes no sense at all. None. Not even a little sense. Maybe in fucking 1998 or some bullshit, but not in 2020 when, like I said, you're logging in. It should just say, okay, here's all your shit, right? I got another call. Well, that one's definitely, definitely a spam call. All right, we'll get going here.
Yeah, but I just think it's cool that, like I said, everything's working. You know, the fact that I can do what I'm doing. Because, again, most people, what they're doing is they're playing PC games using their controllers. They're not do, really doing what I'm doing. You know, they want to be on the PC playing their PlayStation and Xbox, but they want to use their controller. You know what I mean? They just want to be on the PC because they're not around their Xbox or PC. See, what you can do is you can be at work or you can be on vacation someplace, any place in the world. And as long as you have the code from your PlayStation, you can go ahead and put that code in whatever computer you're at and you can your PlayStation will be you'll be able to connect to your PlayStation and play remotely. That's what the whole concept is. Is to be able to play on your PlayStation any place in the world. But you gotta have a fast internet connection to make it work right. See? So that's so this is for people that you can go to work and you can play on your PlayStation at work as long as you got a fast computer. And this program lets you take your controller to work and basically you can fire up that program and it'll recognize your controller. You know, and you can re or you can remap your keyboard and mouse at work to act like a controller. You know what I mean? So so it's a very beneficial program. It's only six dollars. It works, obviously, because I'm using it. Yeah, it's only six bucks, so well, the, the hardware option to this that you can go buy, there's a hardware option to this, that's $105, man, for this. It's like a little USB thumb drive. Now that, though, unfortunately, will get recognized as cheat software. Because you got to remember, I'm playing a game right now that has easy anti-cheat. See, and I'm not cheating. I'm not doing anything. All I'm doing is, is using a keyboard and mouse. But... People consider that cheating on the console because you got better aim and better control with a mouse than you do a controller when you shoot at somebody. I'm like, well, fuck, how in the fuck is that cheating? I'm not, it's like, I'm just using a keyboard and mouse. I'm not using any, in other words, there's no software that's running to, that allows me to do anything other than what the game allows you to do. Like when you go in here and in the controls for Division 2, and it has aim assist, right? And all that bullshit. That's the only thing I have turned on. Same shit. I have the same shit turned on that everybody else has turned on. So there, I don't have any fair advantage. Now, if you run Kronos Max, that's a different program. Kronos Max is a cheating program. That program is specifically designed for you to cheat. 100% guaranteed. That's people who cheat in the Division 1... Because there's no anti-cheat software in Division One, that's the program they're using is Chronos Max. Can you can buy that for sixty bucks, and that is a cheat program. That one you can see through walls and you can mark people. And once you mark them, they stay fucking marked and everywhere. You know, you can sh shoot through walls. You know, it's like it's like crazy, man. It's it's like a super crazy program. So that one now, it just doesn't work very well on PC. That one's designed for consoles. You know, on PC, they do script files and all that crap. So there's, there's a lot, but like I said, all I want to do is be able to play the game just the same way as everybody else. No unfair advantage, so... But I'm just an old ass motherfucker and I can't learn how to play with a fucking controller. You know what I mean? So why should I be punished? The fact that you guys don't have native support for keyboard and mouse is ludicrous, man. Like I not even fucking the next not even PlayStation five and Xbox X. They're not even gonna have support for keyboard and mouse. It's like there's this whole fucking hate on, man. Oh, you can't use a keyboard and mouse. You have to use a controller. I'm like, why? Oh, that's right, because the guys that fucking fly, fly the Predator drones and shit from Kansas, they go blow people up halfway around the world. Guess what they're using? An Xbox controller, PlayStation controller. It's exactly what they sit there with to fly the Predator drone. Well, whatever. No, it's a fuck the handicap is good for fucking retarded old people like me that can't use a fucking controller, man. I know, but you Yeah, well, that's what we're talking about.
talking about? Oh my god, N7 while when you're sick now? Holy shit, dog. God damn it. I get this thing going and you're sick. Cecily Mia doesn't feel good. What the fuck? I know Chet the Chili Meister has this though. Chet, the Chili Manager. I call it Chili Meister, but Chili Manager, she has it because I saw her playing this today. I can I can look on my, right now in my notebook, I can see what's on my PlayStation and I can see friends and what they're playing. Yep, I can just click right here. Oh. Yeah, retry it again. That's because you're a dorks. Yeah, we can see who's playing what. Chat's playing right now. It says that she's playing Tom Clancy to Division 2. Insomniac's playing Division 2. Lethal's playing Destiny 2. And everybody else is in chill mode. So that's it. So Chet's the Chili Manager's around. She is around. Oh, yes. She's off doing her thing. But thank you for being here for moral support there, Stud Muffin. You rock there, Mr. N7. Now, I can adjust my mouse, too. They have, like, a micro, a micro setting to go in there and adjust the sensitivity. So I might go in there and turn it down a little bit. But right now, it's not bad. And the game looks good. It's running great. So I'm just blown away that... Shock Tide. Not only am I causing trouble on Division 2, I'm causing trouble on Division 2 on the PlayStation. That's even more scarier, huh? Hey, get away, man. You cats are just like driving me crazy with your shit. Yeah, you cat yeah you yep on the playstation man what can i say it's hard on the playstation but you want to see what's even weirder look at the title look what the title of the stream is bro and try to try to figure that out what i'm doing See if you can figure out what Sarge is doing. Because a lot of people are having trouble grasping what I'm doing. Now, the reason this is working so well is because my router... My router is sitting right next to my computer and my PlayStation. So literally the signal's moving a foot, if that, between the two of them. So that's why everything looks so good. As far as how good the game looks. And how smooth it is. You know, I can run it in 1080p. You'll be moving through our hyena territory. They're a bunch of vicious assholes who prey on the weak and vulnerable and kill for kicks. Oh, first thing you're going to do is, see this tree over here? You're going to go over here and get this collectible, because it's dead. There's a grave over here, and George Washington's sword's over here. Shut up, dude. Oh, motherfucker. Go ahead. Go ahead. You done? 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 Shut. Zip it. Zip it real good. Holy mother of God. Oh, now Shock Tide's getting confused. He's like, wait a second. He's like, what the hell does this title say? If I'm reading this title correctly, he says that you can play on your PlayStation, right? With a keyboard and mouse, but on a PC? Am I reading that correctly? Sarge is on a computer right now. And he's playing the game. I don't believe it, man. I think Sarge is lying. I think it's a clickbait video, everyone. I think you're all getting sucked in, man. I think Sarge is on the fucking PlayStation. And he's he's shucking and jiving you guys, man. Sucking and jiving everyone, man. Jive turkey talk. 
What do you think about that, Chalk Tide? I smell something cooking. Are you burning something on the stove? I thought, thought there might be something downstairs cooking. Are you sure? Yeah. Yeah. The furnace is going, as you can hear it, right? I had to go and buy that new jet. As soon as I put it in, man, that thing was like all glowy, man, because it should be where well, you can't even look inside of there. It's so bright. Yeah, and it wasn't like that before, so it was getting plugged. So it wasn't working, right? So it was probably wasting fuel, too. Not heating, so... <laughs> Look at Shock Tide. It thinks it's impossible. Shock Tide. What do you want to bet, man? Okay, first off, do you guys know that George Washington's sword is here? Base match. Huh? Of interest detected. See, you guys didn't know that George. Tell me you knew that George Washington. He goes, no, Sarge. You're on a fucking PlayStation because I see the little goddamn PlayStation Square right there. If you want a fucking PC, it'd have some fucking key icon there, huh? He's like, oh yeah, see, Sarge ain't fooling me. Fuck no, man. He goes, that motherfucker's talking shit, Sar talking shit. <laughs> Fuck no, man. <laughs> I can hear myself. Fuck no, man. He says, wait, no, because Sarge got the square, so we know if he's got a square, see? He goes, oh, no, man. Sarge pressed the square. He pressed the square. He says, I seen him press the goddamn square on a fucking controller, Sarge. You're shucking and jiving us. Oh, 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 jive talking. Do, 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 do. I said jive talking. <laughs> Look at shock tide, man. 600,000, huh? All right. You sure? You ready for this? You sure now? You want to keep betting me? You want to bet me, bro? That I'm not on that I'm not on my PC. How much you want to bet? How much more you want to fucking lose, baby? Huh? He's like, what the fuck? Sarge is on his fucking PlayStation, on his fucking PC. Oh yeah, you seen it here first, folks. We were rocking it. Yep, rocking it, man. It can be done. It can be done, kids. Don't let them tell you it can't. It can be done. And you see the time. So you see I'm not lying, right? <sighs> Fuck you. We're coming to collect, motherfucker. I'm sending guys over a big fucking baseball bat. Oh, no. Fuck that shit. Nope. Nope. That ain't happening, dog. Nope, 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 nope. Don't play that. You jive turkey, you. Don't you jive turkey me, turkey. He's like, how is it possible, Sarge? How in the fuck are you on your fucking PlayStation? I'm on my PlayStation. I swear, man. I'm on my PlayStation. I'm not lying to you, baby. If I'm lying, I'm dying, baby. If I'm lying, I'm dying. Oh, yeah. All right. So, remember I told you don't go buy a bunch of guns at that dude? Buy your little body armor and shit first, right? Oh, yeah, you're screwed, man. You're screwed, doggy. You're going you're gonna to pound the pooch, man. Pound the poochie. All right, now let's see if my freaking thing works because this is, should pull up my... Oh, see, now it's not working. God damn it. You guys are killing me. All right, I need to reprogram that to another key also, if I can. I can press those, but those aren't close enough to where I really want to program them to, so... <sighs> Let me turn down this audio on my notebook over here, man. Agent requesting backup. Yeah, we're going to do backup calls and all that shit, too. There we go. Turn my audio down. 
So, yeah, so you see, it is possible to do all this shit. Just let you guys know. And I told you to be careful with the gear because last time I bought gear, I got, the, I got a higher level 2 stuff. So let's see what we got here. Not just some components. Portable electronic device detected. Yeah, it's right up on top is the device right above us. Yep, so I'm on my PC using my Logitech keyboard and mouse, bro. Running, you know, Windows and doing my thing. That's why I can play with everybody. See, remember I told you don't go buy that gun at the store? Because see, look what we just got, right? Does that make sense? See, now we just equipped that one, man. Now we're rocking. Oh, there you go, man. See? Knee pads. Yes, sir. So, like I said, there's a method to this whole madness, too, of what you're doing even in here when you first start. Um, it's cool to get over there and do what you got to do. But loot. Loot. It's all about looting in this game. This building's got a lot more shit inside. There's more loot and gear. So, but yeah, it's, um, yeah, so we're running the PlayStation on the PC. Next thing I'll do is do the same thing with the Xbox. I can run an Xbox remote through my PC also. Then I can, see, because what's cool is I can just use my recording software that I've been using. I don't have to change anything. I can just hit record or I can hit stream just like I've been doing all along. See, where other people with PlayStation, you got to go through all this bullshit to try to stream or you got to output to a computer and then use OBS and all this other bullshit. I don't have to do that. I just have to hit, hit my record key or hit my stream key and bam, software starts streaming or starts recording. So that's the cool part, man. It's like I don't have to do all that other bullshit along with it too, which is crazy. So that's the that's the best part, also. So I can sit here. I can use my uh, all my computer setup basically. I mean, I can stop playing this and switch over to Division Two on the PC instantly, and not even stop the stream, and just switch from one to another. So, like I said, so, and, you know, that's, like I said, and it does work. So, for six dollars, you, you're not going wrong getting this program for six bucks. Now, again, a lot of people like playing with their controllers on the PC, so it's designed to do that, too. It's designed to allow you to let you use your controller and set up all your keys and all that shit the way you want. So even in that sense, if you you know if you're just using a PlayStation Dual Shock or the Xbox, and you want to use your controller on PC to play games, you can use this program, and it works be it works good because it allows you to use everything on it. Success. All right, let's go up here and get... I don't hear him shooting anymore. That's why I was waiting for everybody to stop shooting. And see, I have my keys mapped exactly how I play my computer game. So it's not like I'm not... I'm using exactly the same keys. So it's not like I have to figure out, oh, I got to use different keys or... Nope. So that's the cool thing. <coughs> Excuse me. 
Oh, something called it. Got the Iowa delegation on board. If they get the amendment about biofuels. How many are left in the Iowa delegation? Four. The rest are all sick. Well, let's hope those four stay healthy. Who else can we count on? Hey, just got this. The junior senator from Nebraska just sent her staff home for the duration. Damn it! We were counting on her support once we got through the house. We have to wonder. Oh hell yeah, there's a better, better one than we have. Yeah. I mean. Nice. Shock tight, it's like fucking crazy, bro. I mean, it's crazy, dog. And normally, you know what the that people that stream on the PlayStation can only stream at 720, right? So you guys can only watch at 720. That's the other problem with the PlayStation. You can't stream at 1080p. See, I can stream at 1080p HD in 60 frames. Because <laughs> I'm using an 8 gig video card, right? To push everything out, correct? But the cool part is, since I have 100 megabytes coming and going fiber optic, it's very smooth. You know, you don't, you know, people that try this with 10, 10 megs and shit, it ain't going to fly, man. You need at least 50 meg connection to get it to work correctly. But that's working great, man. Once I map all the keys, so I have everything, I can just keep pushing the keys I normally push to open stuff and delete and, you know, mark stuff. Yep, then I'll upload this file because I'm a lefty also. So this will be great for all the Division 2 players and Division 1 because the keys are pretty much mapped the same for both of them. You know, there's a few variants in Division 1 that I'll have to change, but not too many. But yeah, all in all, man, this thing fucking is, it's like, I can't believe it actually worked. But I had the developer, one of the developers, one of the managers, um, come on the live stream and he sat on Discord and walked me through how to set it up. So it was actually pretty easy in one sense, but I just told him, you guys need to talk on your video. They got this crazy fucking elevator fucking music going on and you're like, what the fuck? It's like, fuck the elevator music, dude. Have somebody explaining to somebody what the fuck. Don't just assume we can follow the mice. And then the video is so fast, you have to slow it down. Because it's really like 15 minutes worth of shit and four and a half fucking minutes or some crazy. And I'm like, what the fuck, dude? I'm like, can you guys actually slow the video down a little bit and make a little bit, you know, easier to understand what the fuck is going on? And maybe somebody could actually talk to the elevator music. You know, because he had no trouble explaining it to me, typing, right? In that sense, so. And it's pretty intuitive once you learn it. That's why I said, well, you know what? Let me put up a video. So that's why the earlier video today was going through the whole thing and setting it up. See, and now it's just a matter of tweaking it. All we got to do is when we alt-tab out to the program, we can set up whatever key we want to set up. Click on save, click on apply, and come back in the game, and that key will then work. You know, so basically we're mapping everything off of a PS4 controller to a keyboard on the fly, which is even better. You know, but yeah, like I said, the cool thing is you're mimicking everything you already do if you're a PC player. So there's no learning curve other than setting the program up. Once you get it set up, that's why I said if I can do it for everybody and it makes it that much easier for them, they can just load mine up, fire up the game, and away they go. You know, they're not like going, oh my God, what do I got to do? I got to do this and I got to do that. And so, nope, it's pretty, pretty straightforward. 
You just have to name everything. So when they go in there, they see exactly what you've done as far as naming it. And I told the company, you guys could do the same thing. I said, you could set up a basic program for the basic games. I said, you know, there's only a couple dozen games that people play for the most part. I said, so you guys could have a drop-down menu with that game, and we could pick it, and it would automatically load up a default keyboard and mouse setup, you know. And instead of having WASD to move like right-handed people use, all I got to do is go in there and change it to the arrow keys on those, and that would be it, you know, for the most part. So, no, nope, it'd be pretty easy to make a whole keyboard layout. That wouldn't be hard to do. But we're doing it, man. We're doing it our way, the Sarge way. So again, I'm going to farm the rest of this building. I'm going to drop back down and go around because there's more shit on the other side. But again, so this makes, you know, people like see Legit Camper. He has a PlayStation. He has a PC, right? But he has a lot of games on the PlayStation that he doesn't have on the PC. So he could do the same thing and you in you know use that program and be able to do basically what I'm doing. Cuz once I upload that, he could download it cuz you can upload to the community so anybody can download at that point. So, like I said, it's a, it's a cool thing. It's running good. I don't have to deal with the Uplay launcher. Now, has anybody heard anything about Broke Point? In all my excitement today, I didn't bother to check on Reddit. So did anybody bother to go check for us? If not, I'll go check right now real quick. Hold on. Go to Broke Point Land. Since we're supposed to have an update tomorrow, right? Oh, here you go. Immersion note mode update. All right, here it is. Uh huh. Earlier this year, we shared that the new immersion mode and the engineer class were coming by the end of February. After careful consideration by our development team, we have decided not to move their release. Our object with the new immersion mode is to provide an impact update to the game using your feedback as a foundation. Immersion mode is built upon the results of the community survey, your observation guided by our community manager's workshop, the Dell Company, alongside extensive play testing. We are in the process of creating an experience that will change the way you are able to play Top Clients Ghost Run Recon Breakpoint. The complexity and integration of this new mode is pretty to be challenged. We want to ensure that experience will be great as ones we release. Immersion mode is still will still be released this spring. And in your class, we will assign immersion mode. The request uh, more transparency and to provide this where possible. A lot of moving parts. Uh, apologize and uh, check back on March the fifth. Ah, 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 ah. See. Told you gonna f you guys in the ass, man. See, told you, told you, told you, told you. There you go, man. No, it ain't gonna, it ain't gonna be tomorrow. Oh look, I am with her. He goes, yeah, like Sarge is like really surprised. I could, and they waited till the last fucking moment to tell you guys too. Uh, oh, an emergent mode not gonna be released tomorrow for Broke Point, but it will be released this spring sometime. 
So spring officially is till June 21st, if you want to know when summer starts, folks. That's June 21st. I'll let you know right now. Mark it on the calendar. Breakpoint immersion mode. June 20th. <laughs> 1159 p.m. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god I told you guys dude I have dealt with this company for years man they are in a total meltdown mode man everybody's getting fucking reshuffled people are getting fired everybody's pointing the fucking finger at everybody you don't lose a half a billion dollars without heads rolling folks that's not how it works in the real world for a company, oh, that doesn't have a fucking union, by the way. Wait, you think Ubisoft has a union? They might in France, maybe, but I doubt it. I don't I don't think they have a union. Last time I checked. <laughs> no. I'm telling you, you guys don't know what's going on. That game is broken, man. No, and that means they're going to push back everything else. You're lucky if you're going to get you're going to get chapter 2 at the end of March 31st like they said. You'll be lucky if it comes out, man. <laughs> I'm telling you guys, man. You got that game is like it's got the worst luck of a video game other than you know what other game it compares to? How many of you guys have been playing Ubisoft games for a long time? For like 20 years. Let's say. Have you ever heard of a game that Ubisoft did called Prince of Persia? Any of you? Agent in need of backup. I gotta go post that over on Discord, man. Hold on, folks. Hold, hold your horses, man. Hold on. People are going to be like so excited when they see this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm just, Sergeant, just so excited to bring you such exciting news. Well, if you guys remember Prince of Persia, that was one of their other games that was a big-ass bomb, man. Literally, that game, like, bombed. Other than... Other than... How about Assassin's Creed Unity? Did any of you guys play Assassin's Creed Unity? Another great title from Ubisoft. Oh, sorry, Shock Tide. So, sorry to be the bearer of bad news, man, on a Monday. Monday, Monday. <laughs> yep, it's a Monday, man. <sighs> Shall I give you any other good news, Shock Tide? He's like, no, that's it, dude. Shut the fuck up. Oh, Sarge's got lots of stuff. What else you want me to tell you, man? You want to tell you some more good shit? I'll tell you some more good shit, man. I'll make you re I'll make you cry like a little baby. I'll make you cry like a baby. <laughs> I can make you cry like a baby. Cry like a baby. Go on. Start crying like a baby right now. <laughs> Sarge make me cry like a baby. I don't want to cry like a baby. You can't make me cry like a baby. See? Just made you. God damn you, I did too, man. Whisper sweet nothings. Oh, I can go that. What is that? ASQD or whatever the ASQ. Uh, what the hell is that shit called again? Come on, what do you guys fucking know? I know you motherfuckers listen to them goddamn fucking Russian girls with the big titties doing that. Come on. Come on, what do you guys give it up, man? Come on. Give it up. When do you guys know what I'm talking about? I'm going to play dumb. You guys are going to be like, oh, you mean this? Come on. Sarge could do that. Somebody already told me I should do that shit. 
I should get one of the microphones and just sit there and just talk like real soft and shit. Oh, yeah. They said I could probably get a big follower of ladies, man. And maybe some men. But definitely ladies. Mm -hmm. I think so. Yeah, that yeah, that one's where the ladies talk they like whisper. ADPR ADPR <laughs> ADPR Oh my god. Yep. ADPR sounds pretty good, man. We'll just go with that. That's that sounds good to me. ADPR, man. Anyways, I um that one would it's fucking listen to this shit. When I first God damn, where's the sunshine, man? I got you guys seeing my face. Hey, what's up, doggy? Oh my god, look at it's like a little wiener dog, man. Oh my god, it's like a wiener dog. Oh, it's a basset hound or something. Come back here, you little motherfucker. I'm not gonna eat you, man. I got plenty of MREs, man. I'm not like these savages here in Washington. I have to eat the doggies. Where the fucking sun at? God damn it. Get some sun on my face. Anyways, you can sort of see me. He'd be in the shadows. Yeah, the first time, one of the times I was on Twitch, right? You know, I'm streaming on Twitch, okay? So when I'm not streaming, you know, I was like tripping around, right? And I saw that, and I was wondering what it was, right? I had no idea what the fuck it was. And I said, oh, what the hell is this, right? Yeah, so I go over there. And first off, it's hard to find anybody doing it in English, right? The first one I went to, this lady was like, I couldn't hear her, and then she would write stuff down and then hold it up, right? She'd, like, write it with a felt pen on white paper and hold it up, and then she'd whisper something and do that again and hold it up. So, you know, like a dumb shit what I do? <laughs> you gotta, I mean, you guys know what I did, right? Because I'm like, what the fuck? I'm turning up my volume and shit. And I'm like, is it, what the fuck? Is there something wrong with my fucking computer? I'm checking my sound. I'm checking, like, everything. I'm like, no, my shit's fine. I check some other web page, you know, some other Twitch streams that are blasting. I go back over there. I'm like, so I type in the chat to this lady. Hey, there must be something wrong with your microphone because I can't hear you. Can you talk louder? <laughs> then I don't hear nothing for a couple minutes. And I'm like, oh, what the fuck, bitch? So I type in there again. Hey. I said, you might want to check your microphone. I said, I don't know if you understand English, but I can't hear you. Can you please turn up the volume? <laughs> then I still don't hear nothing. I'm like, well, what the fuck, man? I'm like, fuck this bitch. I'll just go find another one, man. I'm like, she probably don't even understand English. So now I'm like, do the filter thing to try to find English ones. And they're still all Russian girls, but they sort of speak English, right? And then there was some Japanese girls or Chinese or Korean, you know. So I went to another one. And then she was doing some weird shit. She had like, I don't know, man, like dildos and vibrators or, you know, like French ticklers. And I mean, all sorts of weird shit. She was like rubbing and doing shit with with her hands next to a little microphone thing. And the same thing. I couldn't hear shit. And I'm like, well, this is like some crazy ass shit. So I did the same thing. I'm like, you know, I said, I don't know what's going on with you people, but I can't hear anything you're saying. I'm like, I have to strain to hear you. I said, I got my goddamn surround sound turned up. and It is a goddamn thousand watt per channel. I said, I'm going to blow out the fucking neighbors here if I turn on another fucking anybody else. I said, I can still can't understand you. Yeah. And then somebody else typed in chat. Oh, what the hell? Is what's wrong with you, man? This is like... That's when they try to go, why don't you go Google it? So that's what I did. And I was like, oh, so this is for people who get all excited when somebody fucking whispers to them. I'm like, really? Holy shit. Guess Sarge ain't going down that road too much. He's a whispering type, so... Anyways, yep. So I was like tripping on that whole thing. That was my first experience, man, with the whispering ladies. I was like, oh my God, man. And then I thought, well, hell, why can't I just have one when I fucking yell at people, right? If people want them where they whisper, why can't I have a Sergeant Fury one where you just come in there and I scream and fucking yell at you the whole time, right? 
and and call you a dirt bag and tell you to drop and give me fucking 20 and you're a scum bucket and you ain't worth fucking shit and nobody would ever fucking game with you for because you're a piece of goddamn fucking useless fucking crap and maybe you got your fucking shit together and put your goddamn fucking head out of your fucking ass sometime then maybe somebody might consider being a fucking gamer with you but then in the fucking real world you'd have to fucking shade that fucking braided fucking armpits that you have and shave your goddamn fucking legs and act like a goddamn girl. Oh, and if you're a guy, get rid of that goddamn fucking man bun. Stop wearing tight-ass motherfucking jeans and shit. <laughs> Worry about manicuring and goddamn fucking fingernails. <laughs> Grow a dick between your fucking legs. Oh, that type of fucking abuse? I can do that shit. And pay me on top of that? And pay me? Oh, my God. It's so uh, the world has... Change the new, man. <laughs> what can I say? <laughs> Don't laugh too much, man. You'll have to fucking pay me. If you laugh more than three times, you have to pay me money. That would be a whole new experience. I could do that, man. I can get all fucking abusive on motherfuckers, man. Yeah. Well, there wouldn't be too much to watch. It would just be, be people coming in the chat and me talking shit about you in chat. That's all. and just But just talk shit about you the whole fucking time till you left, till I kicked you out of chat. Till I literally just fucking, I would leave you there talking shit, and then I would give you 300 second time out. <laughs> there you go. How's that, man? And make you give me five fucking dollars, too. <laughs> Donate five dollars, then I'll kick your ass out of the fucking chat. There you go. Goddamn motherfuckers. Oh, yeah. Unless we have to go all private, see? You know how some ladies have to get in there into the private Discord and, you know, who's been a bad girl, right? Who needs to be spanked, all that type of shit. So... Then we might have to go extra here. Sarge might have to go the extra mile for the team. Take one for the Gipper. <laughs> oh, yeah. I have to go over in the Discord over there and get all Discordy. Which, I'm trying to figure out how to stream out of Discord. Oh, my God. I tried that last night, and it didn't work worth shit. I tried, and I tried, and I tried, and I tried, man. Jesus fucking Christ, man. Their instructions are just as wacky as this other people, so... Because somehow... It's Mr. Ortiz. What's up there, sir? Yeah, somehow we can stream out of Discord. See, we don't even have to use YouTube. I can actually go to Discord, and I can stream over there. We can have music and all that shit. See, so you guys can just come over to Discord, and you can sit in the voice channel and chat if you have a microphone. Or you can just sit in the text, you know, just sit there and, and type. <sighs> But I couldn't figure out how to do that. I tried that last night. I'm going to try that again. I'm going to get that whole thing rocking too somehow. But, Mr. Ortiz, look what we're doing, bro. On the PC, keyboard, mouse. That's it, baby. We're doing everything, man. We're rocking it, man. The big enchilada. We're doing it, man. We are on PC rocking, rocking, man. We got everything working. Now I got to fine tune it. You know, like when you go into your inventory. Um, so I even got the map to work if I hit my M key. See, hit my M key and the map opens up. I hit my M key. So now I got to do like I for inventory, that type of shit. Well, what happened, Mr. Ortiz, is I had the guy from the company. I, I said, he said, well, could you send me a screenshot? And I'm like, dude, I can do you one better, bro. <laughs> I said, I said, I can fire up a live fucking stream and you can come on a live, a live stream and tell me what the fuck I'm doing wrong. So, because the program's only $6. Because you realize what I'm doing now, Mr. Ortiz, is I'm playing on my PlayStation on a PC and all I had to do is fire up my recording software. You don't have to use a, a output card and all that bullshit and use OBS and all that crap, right? You can just simply have your your router and your PC and your PlayStation all hooked up right next to each other, fire up PlayStation Remote, 
fire up their software, map your keyboard and mouse, and start playing. And then hit record, and it starts using your Windows. So I'm on Windows. I'll show you. See? Hold on. See? So we're in Windows, but I'm playing on my PlayStation. Well, no, what you do is you come over here, see over here, and you map the keys here to what they're going to be over here. And what you do is you name them. See, I have these named already. Skill, melee, emotes, roll, dodge, up, armor kit, left, right, vault, grenades. See, I named them, but that's what they would look like on your controller. See, it would look like, a, you know, the, the triangle, the, the square, right? Your the touchpad for your map, you know, all your paddles for, yep. So you may, you can do that and you can also map your mouse too. If you want, you can map your mouse. See, I have a mouse for my left and right for aim and, oh yeah. Once you do that, you save it, okay? And then you click, and at the same time, you have PlayStation remote is running so i'm running the game then you click on apply and what it does is now it's emulating a ps4 pro controller see when you click on apply hold on Hold on. I'm getting to work in here. Oh, I got... Sorry, I got to hit this key. All right, there you go. So now what you do is you hit that, that key again. Oops. God damn it. You go back into the game. Just... Oh. Hold on. Let me get... Let me close up this menu. My living room's halfway dark right now. So, yeah, you alt-tab back into the game. Oh, my God. There we go. Okay, and then you hit your Windows key, right? That win key. Oh, God damn it. You motherfucker. And that disables your... That turns, in other words, when you hit your left wing key, it turns the controller off and on, is what I'm trying to say, Mr. Ortiz. Because, remember what we were talking about, Mr. Ortiz? You don't have mouse support in a game. See, right now I'm using my mouse. That's my mouse. You don't have mouse support. You got keyboard support, but they don't have, they only have a couple of stupid games with mouse support. So you can't play like Dead by Daylight and all that shit by using the power of your PC, right? Because I'm also using my graphic card, correct? Because I'm pushing everything out to my computer. And then my computer is what's outputting it to the internet to you guys. Yeah. But the whole thing is I'm using my mouse. So that's my mouse turning. That's my right mouse button. That's my left mouse button. And they're working on the scroll, getting the scroll working so I can scroll through my weapons like I normally do. Now open the door, I just have it mapped to my F key. So my F key is open, you know, interact, all that shit. Because remember, that's why you were complaining too. Because you said, see, I have a keyboard and mouse hooked to my PlayStation, right? I tried that first and it didn't work. And I was like, oh, fuck that shit. I said, that motherfucker's not even fucking working, man. I'm like, nah. It works great for, like, filling out shit. Your keyboard works great, but your mouse is very limited. Whereas this, this works perfect. You know, yeah, granted, you have to own a PC, but that's not my problem, right? Exactly. For Fortnite and Apex Legend, it has built-in PS4 support, correct?
Yeah. Now, if you're a streamer, right? Because a lot of people like to stream, right? But they don't want to stream from PS4. See, I can also stream in 1080. How are you watching right now? In 720 or 1080? See, because that's the other problem. If you're on Xbox or PlayStation, for the most part, you're stuck at streaming at 720. That's the most, I can stream at 1080p 60 frames. Which is a hell of a big difference for people watching. Now, but you stream directly from your PlayStation though, right? Correct? Which I have that service now. I bought that service for a year. The PlayStation Now or PlayStation Plus or whatever the hell it's called. We can connect and stream and all that from your PlayStation directly to YouTube or Twitch. Or do you output to a PC? Ah, with encoding on. Cool. Okay. Now, you know, so have you ever streamed to a PC from the PlayStation? You know, like a lot of people stream to a PC and then, yeah, the PlayStation Plus, correct. On PC? See, because I could use that service now too, right? I could fire up those games and do the same thing, right? But see, they require PlayStation Plus and PlayStation Now on the PC, require you to have a a dual shock controller to play those games see and not exactly see you have to use obs correct capture card all that correct versus remote play see i'm doing remote play on the pc and i can just fire up the raytheon like i normally do right and just stream away and it saves, you know what I mean? I don't have to use OBS. Because if I use that, I then I have to try to have two monitors hooked up and all that shit. See, so remember I have a cable running across my living room to my TV set. So I don't want to have all that. And I'm watching you guys on a notebook, right? As far as the chat and all that bullshit and looking up crap for people. Yeah, so this is working out great. And I can do it with Xbox too. I can work do Xbox as a remote also. Right. Well, that's what I'm just saying. So it alleviates that step of having to use OBS also. You know, if you have NVIDIA, NVIDIA has Ansel, you can use that. And, and AMD has a Raytheon Relive. So it gives you the option of using either one of those programs, which, you know, work natively with the video card. So there's really not too much to do. You do. I could have chat on the screen and all that shit if I wanted. I could have all the overlays. I could do special effects, all that crap. All the stuff that you can do in OBS, you can do now with the new version of Raytheon. They have scenes, and you can I can have little animated bullshit across the bottom and all that crap, like on Twitch. I can do all that shit myself. Yeah. Capture screen, then add audio source. Capture audio, then add my overlays, and add delay to my own cam. Yeah, but, yeah, but that... Well, for you, it's not hard, it sounds like. I mean, unless... Like, like, see, for legit camper, he has a hard time with OBS. So for him, he has a Raytheon card, right? So all he has to do is do the remote play, you know, get this thing working, and then he can just fire up, you know, just hit his, um, I think it's like right control shift G, and that starts streaming live. And right control shift R is record. So for him, it's one less thing that he has to mess with. <laughs> Because he has a hard time with OBS. And me, I just figured, eh, if it's just one less program I have to worry about. And I can just, like, you know, sit here and just, you know, fire this up and fire up the stream. And I'm running around and we're having a good time. And, you know, it looks good. And I'm having, you know, it feels good. Oh, you're kidding. You're kidding. So after all that, you ate up so much CPU, RAM, so much. O OBS is really weird like that. The uh, legit camper had the same problem. And hell, she double had the same problem, man. 
with OBS. I'm not quite sure how you have to configure that program, but that program is very like weird. Some people say they have lots of, but then there's a couple versions of it too, right? There's the OBS standalone, and then there's a Streamlabs version, and which is the other problem. So I'm not quite sure, bro. This is why I shied away from that, because it didn't seem too hard at first to set up, but I didn't like the first time I did it. It didn't look the way I wanted it to look. I don't know. You stream from your Mac to Live Legal Edge? Oh, okay. Well, yeah. Macs have a tendency to work. Everything works good, bro. Uh-oh. <laughs> as soon as you hook up your capture card. Oh. Uh, now, is that a capture card going to the Mac? Because you know how sensitive Macs are to what hardware you hook up to them. They ha it has to be like Mac-friendly hardware. So there might be some type of device driver or something that you have to get for that capture card. So it enjoys, because Macs are very, very finicky. I know Pinnacle was one of the only companies that you could actually hook shit up for years for a video capture card. You had to use Pinnacle cards for one of the cards. From PS4 to Mac. but So that capture card is Mac friendly though, right? It says like for Mac and PC or just for Mac or I, I'm not quite sure. What, what card you're using. I just know that, that that seems weird that you would have a problem. So obviously the, the, the bottleneck is the capture card, right? Something doesn't like the capture card. Either OBS doesn't like the card or your Mac doesn't like the card. But, and I think that's the same thing that's happened to uh, Legit. And he was using, I think... Oh, I think that happened to Chet, too, and she was using her Mac. Ah, uh, we'll have to ask. Next time Chet the Chili Manager comes around and Legit Camper, we'll ask them, Mr. Ortiz, because I know Chet with her Mac, she was having the same problem, and then I believe he was doing it to his PC. They, that's what she said. That's what Chet the Chili Manager told me. She said that her the graphic processor in her Mac was just like right on the edge of what you needed to get the game to run. That's exactly what she said. You know, as far as like video capture and outputting and all that crap. Yeah, because she was having the same issue, I believe. And I think what happened was that she let legit use that capture card because they both have PlayStations. So that's why the capture card, I think then he took it, and I believe he was outputting, that's how he does his videos for YouTube, some of them. He was output to his computer. So, yeah, we'll have to ask them, bro, and see what they're using. I'm sort of curious. But like I said, I'm totally fucking jazzed that I got this thing working. Just totally freaking jazzed. So this way we can get a clan going or we can just run together here as you guys want to run together because I have everything open so I don't care, you know, somebody joins me. As long as you don't go all Rambo and shit where we'll be on the same page. Wow. Okay, so I run OSP as administrator. Switch your drive to NBENK new and disable preview. And then it works fine. Oh, and then it goes south when you sit switch scenes. Holy mother of God. Now, which OBS is that? Is that the standalone or is that the Streamlabs OBS? Because Streamlabs OBS is built into their whole thing for Twitch. Where you can basically run, run that instead of logging into Twitch's front end. On the internet, you can just use that OBS. That's how the new the new Raytheon is. The Raytheon, I have a preview thing. I can actually go look at this stream and all this shit right now. If I had my if I went out to the desktop, I could show you what we're looking at and all that crap and change the settings. And I have scenes and I can swap scenes and put little bullshit on this screen. Yeah. 
Oh, Streamlabs isn't optimized for Macs. Uh huh. Just OBS for Mac. Well, see, I didn't know. Oh, it's the same as as all my shit, bro. USA Sergeant Nick Fury. I have it down below the description too. I put all my tags down there for Xbox, PlayStation, Steam, and UPlay. They're basically all the same except for Steam, which is the oldest one. Yeah, I have those. I Like I said, that's one of the reasons I gave up on Twitch. Because it's too much work. I want something more streamlined, like we're like this. <coughs> Hold on, I gotta go check my furnace. I changed that nozzle today, man. I want to make sure everything's okay. Be right back. Uh, uh. What's going on there, Dan? Oh, my God. Uh, let me get around here. What do we got? Nope, not going to use that. I hope you're having a good day so far there, sir. We're rocking it. Yeah, so once I fine-tune all these keys, like see where it says item detail, loadout, I still have to be able to um, map those. I, I don't I think I've mapped the L2 and the... R2 yet. That's okay. We don't we don't test people on spelling, bro. Not a problem.
So like I said, we're working our way over to the um, settlement. Correct? Just leave this shit for this right now. All right, so that's what we're doing. We're working our way over there. But again, oh my god, hold on one more time. Let me go check my audio settings here. Volume, 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 cinema, speaker. Oh, yeah. Do that, man. Boost that audio. <laughs> Why not, man? Home cinema. Oh, yeah. Home cinema is good. We can rock that. I might have to turn up. Maybe I have my shit turned out. Nope. Mine's turned up okay. Okay. So, I think we're rocking it. Oh, yeah, they just, you get that in your box. Yep. Yeah, you get this in your box. Look at that. As a gift. Whether we use it or not, yeah, we don't know for sure. Oh, my God, it's nighttime. There's bad guys everywhere. I'm wearing sunglasses. What is it? What, hold on. Let me see. We got a full tank of gas. Half a pack of cigarettes. We're wearing... Or it's, oh, no. Got a full tank of gas. Half a pack of cigarettes. We're wearing sunglasses and it's midnight. I think that's how that saying goes. All right. Let's see what this is over here. I have no idea what's going on because it's dark as shit in this game. But I'm not gonna make any light. Hey, echo detected. So, just gonna say what it is. I can tell you. Activate that echo. Echo this bitch. Decent coffee, right? Yep. Fuck if I know. I don't drink this shit for pleasure. Now make sure that if it tells you to interact with somebody, go interact. Because sometimes you have to, sometimes you don't. Then of course go look for the good shit. Look for the loot. Rootin', scootin', lootin'. I'm gonna remap that key to something else over here on the other side that's closer to me so I don't have to reach across the keyboard. Because I don't like using the F key. So, hold on a second. I'm gonna do this. Go back out to the desktop. You hit your Windows key. And that allows you to come back into here. We go to keyboard, right? Come down, or come up here to F, right? Okay. And I can change that to, you know what I'm going to change it to? What do I do? Something over here that. Let me use that key, the plus key on my numpad. That's easier to get to. Hit numpad, where's my plus? Numpad, enter. Oh, numpad, enter would rock if I could use that, dude. Holy shit, hug. That's what I used to use. Alright, then you click on save, right? Then you click on apply. Alright, and we go back into the game. Wow. We'll have to see if that's going to work. See if we can find some more loot. And you can fine tune your mouse too. They got a micro, a macro. 
to find your macro. They got a macro to fine tune your mouse. If you need to fine tune your mouse, you can do that. Which rocks? What's up, doggy? dark. I don't know what to tell you. Well, that's where we were. We don't want to go that way. We're already here already. Well, what I'm doing now, Mr. Ortiz, is this program is emulating a PS4 DualShock controller on the PC. And then allows you to remap your keys to a keyboard. So basically, you're fooling the computer and you're fooling the PlayStation remote into thinking that you're using... I don't even have a DualShock computer hooked up to my PC. You don't even need a DualShock controller. To do this, all you need is a PlayStation. You just need a PlayStation and a PC. That's it. it the, the program emulates a DualShock controller or it'll emulate a Xbox 360 or a Nintendo. Yeah, it, it just emulates them. So you don't actually need the controller at all. And then when you fire up the PlayStation remote, it thinks... That you're it, that it's connecting to a PlayStation DualShock controller, when in actuality it's not. That I don't have one hooked up to my computer at all, because you, the program mimics does all the work for you. That's how it's very easy. So basically, it tricks your PlayStation into thinking that you're using a DualShock controller, when I don't even have a DualShock controller. I have one, but I'm not. It's not hooked up to anything. It's just sitting there, turned off. So that's the that's the cool part of the whole thing. Oh, here we go. So we have a loot. Let's see if I can loot it with that key now. See, it's still tied to that. It just doesn't want to let me tie it to this key over there. Oh, hold on. Oh my God! It did it right to the key that I have it on on the PC. All right, so now we're rocking. Cool. All right. So we're, we're doing good now. So now I can loot just like I do on the PC with the same exact key. Yeah. So basically, you're not even using a controller at all. You don't even have a controller. All I have is an Xbox or a PlayStation. Yep. That's all you're doing. And so that's it. You don't need a... <laughs> that's the cool part. It's for people who want to be able to play... PlayStation games, but don't want to use a controller or don't know how to use a controller, you just buy a PlayStation and use a software and bing, bang, booey. Thank you, it's Tommy, though. You explained it pretty much. It's just, it's actually simpler. It's even simpler than that. You know, it's, it's amazingly simple. You know, when you, it's like, that's why I was a little skeptical that it was six bucks. I'm like, well, you know what? It's like for six bucks, there's got to be like, you know, it may work type thing. But nope, it works. Works fine. What's the matter, you? 
you ain't taking a scope on this man, I will F you up, bitch. Now, yeah, what's the matter, you? Oh my god, I'm just like looting. I'm just like looting the way I want to loot. This is like, this is incredible, guys. I can't tell you how much fun this is because I get to run with Mr. Ortiz and N7 and uh, Legit and Chad and Dream Queen and Cecily Mia and freaking, you know, the list goes on, right? that make sense and it opens up the world like I said to all these people who want to do the same thing but because a lot of people you know have playstations but like I said they just you know Yeah, that's even easier because my all that stuff's off the numpad, and it can be done for next box too, bro. Yes, it can. Here, here, yeah, here, yeah, here, you can do that. This is how to do the. Um, I put it down below. Okay, but I'll show you how to. Um, they have one for Xbox too. Here's all their videos. You can go over here and just look at their videos. And this will, like, this is all their shit. But yeah, you can do it for an Xbox too. As long as you can, as long as Xbox, which Xbox has a remote software program, I know they do. So as long as you can fire up the software program on the PC, you're good to go. That's all it takes. Yeah, see, that's even faster because I can do that with my, um, Oh, somebody just killed them. So I can do that with the with the um, home with the uh, ex enter key on the numpad. So that's even better. Ah, oh, good. The sun's coming up. Yeah, because it's yeah, since I'm left-handed, right, mouse in the left hand, I use the numpad and the arrow keys. So if I can keep everything on that side for a left-handed person, whether they're using the arrow keys and just reaching over for the numpad and the right shift and right control, it'll make it perfect for them. Because there's no configurations up there for a keyboard and mouse right now. I'll be one of the first ones. Most people have them set up for controllers and shit. And nobody has anything for lefties. I'll be the only one to have a lefty one. So then, of course, once I do this, I'll do the Division 1, and I'll do Ghost Recon Wildlands and Broke Point, and, you know, we'll go the whole gamut of all the games. But you see how smooth it is. It's not like, oh, I can't do this or something, right? You know, it's like very smooth and so I'm digging it. You guys are you guys are inspired. Even Captain Sasquatch said you might actually buy a PlayStation. Well, Chalk Tied left handed gameplay, I have my mouse in my left hand, right? So I have my pointer finger on the right mouse button. Okay, and I have my middle finger on the left mouse button and then my thumbs along the right side of the mouse and my rest of my hands cupping the mouse and I can just move the mouse around like that, right? And use my pointer finger and use my middle finger to shoot. That's it. So no difference than if you had it in your right hand, right? The advantage is When you have it set up the way I have it, the arrow keys, if you have a large keyboard, I have a nice size keyboard with a nice 
nice um, palm rest. So there, I have large arrow keys and a large numpad area. So that pretty much maps everything you need. Page up, page down, delete, home, right? All the num keys, the arrow keys. So the arrow keys, I can move left, right, back, forward, straight, you know, turn. As fast as you can do it, I can do it faster on my PC. See, I'm on PlayStation. Look at how fast I can move. You know why? Because I'm using a keyboard and mouse, even though I'm on PlayStation. Yeah, so in that sense, I can still like move like crazy fast, so. Oh, when you had your operation? Yeah, so, well, I've been gaming my whole life lefty. So this is why a lot of people, when they, you know, they say, well, I don't know how you can do it. I'm like, it's actually quite comfortable in one sense because you have more control and it's larger. Like I said, you got more room to move your hands. And so, I don't know, for me, it's fine. So, nope, I'm digging it, man. This is working fine. I gotta get this guy up to 30 so we can start our clan. So we can go do raid, because it takes eight of us to do raid, right? So that's why I'm, I'm, you know... I am getting to the settlement, but like I said, the whole game is based on looting. If you're not willing to loot, then scoot. That's my philosophy, man. Because it's a looter. It's a looter and a shooter. But it's a looter first because all those resources, they'll all make sense down the road. When you have to start doing all these projects to get shit and do crap. And, you know, people start coming up and asking you for shit. And you're like, oh, I didn't know that shit was going to happen. Yeah, so it'll all, it'll all make sense. Oh, God damn it! I forgot to get that electronic device where we were. Son of a bitch. Oh, well. I'll go get it later. But what's cool is they have a... You can go in there and, and they have a sub-menu where you can dial in the sensitivity of the mouse. So you can even make it more sensitive if you need it more sensitive. So that's even better. So, but all in all, like I said, for six bucks, it's a it's a great program, man. So, somebody said, oh, they should give it to you for free for pimping it. I'm like, yeah, I don't care though, man. I just raise my arm and my hand dangles. Oh my god, man! You haven't figured out how to point with your left hand. Shock tied, you're hilarious, dog. You are funny, man. So again, you know, it works fine if I can get it going. See, and again, this gives encouragement because, again, there's a lot of people who just can't play with a controller. You know what I mean? We're, there's a whole older generation that we just can't play with a controller. There's a lot of you that can. A lot of older people can, but there's a guarantee that this will open the door to a lot of people that want to play you know, with their grandkids and, you know, all that shit. And they can do it on their PC and just get a PlayStation, right? And they can remote play and do all this shit. And they can still use a keyboard and mouse. Because and, all they got to do is download my file and install it. And it basically does everything for it, for you. So that's the cool part. But the one thing I figured out is um, a lot of these times. Yeah, see, there you go. There's a little bit of a tizzy going over here. Get him, man. I love the NPCs in this game, man, as far as like. They've really improved them a lot. Yeah, they've really improved the NPCs in this game. 
So again, I can't understand why broke point is broken. Oh, did you hear that, Mr. Ortiz? Sorry, that is that the hold on. Oh, that's not it. Sorry. Um, here you go. Oh, uh, yeah, here you go. For everybody that's just joining the um, stream, you guys might want to read this. Here you go. And then I'll say I told you so later. But it's all good, man. You just do whatever you want to do. And then I'll I'll tell you I told you Where so later, man. Really I got tired of them moaning. Okay. So you let them go? No, I didn't let them go. Do, you, do your thing what first. Fucker, we were going to trade them. Mm -hmm. Oh, well. The dogs of war. Yeah, what dog? Dogs of war, lady. Dogs don't have war. So you think it's like Fido and Fifi and Spot and, and Rover? These are fucking dogs of war, motherfucker. Dogs. What, do what dogs? I didn't see no dogs. I didn't see no dogs. What dogs? Oh my god, lady. At ease there, soldier. Ah, uh, you might be wondering why I called you here today. We're going to deep six this whole project here. Operation Broke Point is broken beyond repair, man. Jesus, they must just give up on that motherfucker, man, because that thing's all fucked up, man. That game is lost, man. That game is lost. Oh, look at that post I just put there, Mr. Ortiz, in case you didn't read that earlier. That's the post I just put up. I'm not going to say I told you so, man, but I told you so. so I'm, I'm not saying anything else. I'm not saying anything else. Nothing. Sarge ain't saying shit. Oops. Sarge ain't saying shit. I'm going over here talking, talking. Talk to my girl, man, Odessa. Hell yeah. Mm. Oh yeah, he's still fine, side. man. Justin, you just got your back with that motherfucker. Sawyer. Try to stay on a good side. Yeah, let's go. Electronic device detected. Well, give it to me. Give it up, man. I want that electronic device. Mother effer. Oh, it's over here. I want it. I demand all electronic devices be handed over immediately. Yo. Where's it at? Outside here somewhere. Yeah. This is upstairs in the homestead. Oh, it might be upstairs. Oh no, it's right here. Q. Tracy, do you copy? What's your status? We started taking fire as soon as we approached the intersection, but it's only a few defenders. <laughs> Look at Mr. Ortiz, man. They said, after special consideration. We're going to lose them. Then let them go. Oh, we can't go that way yet. They can be going for backup. Stay the fuck put. Dad, we got my running down everything, man. Just like, like I said, it's like, I can spray, if I can turn. Jack, be nimble. Jack, be quick. Jack, jump over, but don't burn your dick. Alright, let's go talk to her. Get out with the shenanigans here. Get me an LMG, man, so I can rock this shit. Yeah, man, they said, after special consideration, they said it's going to come out by spring, though. So, I said, well, that means they have till June 21st, since summer doesn't start till June 21st. I said, we got long times, man. Get a long time, man. That's all I can say, folks. Suckers! 
They done took your money and ran, man. It's a Ponzi scheme, man. We take a bunch of money from you and then tell you we're going to make a game and then come up with a bunch of excuses why we can't. It's all good, man. I have faith in, in Buggy Soft that they won't do anything. Watch, I can't wait till chapter two comes out. We'll see what happens. If you're looking for Agent Kelso, she just left. I should have gone with her. But I'd only slow her down. I know you got your own problems to deal with. But them hyena motherfuckers took my little girl. Get to me. If you can help, I'll be on your debt. Oh, fuck and yeah, man. Let's go debt. fuck up them hyena bitches, man. Sounds good to me. I'm ready for some action. Well, Mr. Ortiz... I can't understand why they put that game off. You know what they said? That they put off Skull and Bones until next year. Next year. Portable we're talking... Yeah, we're talking 20, 2021. And they said because they needed to tweak it. I'm like, why? It looked pretty good from what I saw. All the shit they were showing us. Portable that, device that, detected. Yes, yes, yes. Isaac, dude, man. Put up frickin' circuit board in it or something, bro. Hi there. Hi there yourself there, girl. Where's this portable fucking device that I gotta find here? Shut this dickhead up. Oh yeah, you might as well release these things because you gotta deploy these anyways. Right? Because that's all part of your, like, mission thing here that you gotta do. Now the one thing that would be cool, is this like a public space right here? Is that they actually got this place working, right? Where there was a band in here and, you know, you could hang out and, you know, they had music going on and all that shit. That would rock. Because it never changes. It looks just like this. The only part of the settlement that doesn't get fixed up. So again, it's like, it's a, it's a little, little strange, but... Yeah, there we go. Alright, so we got that one. There's another one over here you want to deploy. Where's the other rope at? There's another rope here. You might as well deploy these because you're going to have to deploy them anyways. It's all part of your... Do your thingy shit. Yeah, and then go around and pick up all these. So do, do whatever you got to do here while you're here. First. For the most part. Mm -hmm. Grinding, baby. Kissing, man. Kissing vinegar, man. Okay, now we got all this shit we can sell off, right? We can try to buy more. Well, it's sort of weird, man. Alright, lady. Calm down. Uh, what do we got over here? Good dog, she said. Wow, she's harsh. I need an LMG is what I need. And a better mask, but this will do for now. Oh, yeah. It's just cool, like I said, that you can do this. You know, it makes it makes it so easy for me to get in here and do what I gotta do. Now I do have to figure out how to like um, 
you know, mod and all that crap that's coming up next, but none of these can be modded. So that's what we have to figure out next is how to do the mod sub menus and all that crap to get into the modding area. But I can use my num keys for that for the most part. So, nope. Like I said, I think we're, uh, we're getting there, man. So we can sell all the other crap off that we don't need. Right, let's go over here. Check out the vendor. Ready to make a deal? Yeah. Okay, then I already have these set up already with my F1 and F2 key. See? And basically, you don't need any of this crap, so you can just. Exactly what I needed. And you can see how fast you can sell shit here. I mean, I, that. I can push the button Thanks. faster. Yeah, so as fast you can push the button. So the whole, that's why I said you want to you wanna loot and scavenge as much as you can because you're going to need it so you can I needed that. get rid of all Thanks. this. And you can and then hit your F1 key, go back to buy and see what he has over here. Right, buy and equip you press your one key I and that buys and equips them you happy? I'm happy. so I have to do is set up my get get it to where I can hit one key for my inventory which will rock because right now I got I gotta hit my escape key and then hit that to get in my inventory yeah once I do that that will rock so now we got a better pair on. We get rid of those other gloves. Okay. So then we got an apparel thing going on here. So like I said, that's just fine tuning it. That's not going to be a big deal. Uh, more pants. Shoes. Oh. And what else do we get? Now we can open a bunch of crap. We can do that if you guys want to see me open stuff up. Oh shit, man. I didn't even see him leave. God damn it. I didn't even see Dan Tamlin say he was going to bed, man. God damn shit balls. Sorry, Dan. I'm sorry, bro. Yeah, apparently we got a whole shitload of these. So we can open up some of these things. How does that sound? Oh my god. Got another mask. Cool. Whoops. I'll reveal that item. Another pair of shoes. Holy crap, the music's like American Idol or some shit. Another hat. How do we get back? Okay. Uh -huh. Oh, except, sorry. My bad. All right, let's open up these. Got 11 of these. I'll go open them up, man. Freaking music over the top, man. Another pair of tennis shoes. EMS shoes. There you go, Miss Ortiz. We're EMS shoeing it, Miss Ortiz. Oh, we got night vision goggle thingies.
Oh, well, sorry you hear me mashing all the keys, bro. Maybe we'll try to figure out some way to uh, turn that down so you don't hear the, you don't hear the mashing so bad. What is that? I was looking at Mr. Ortiz has gotten all excited about the EMS. Oh my God, I got a ranger hat. About the EMS shoes? We'll have to show you those, Mr. Ortiz. They look like uh, clogs, like some type of clogs. We'll have to see what they are. Yeah, we'll, we'll see what they are. Oh, another duplicate island, another hat. Oh my god, man, the fucking music is over the top. Oh, high guard dress shoes. They look like the EMS shoes. <laughs> Wait a second, man. Goddamn shoes look the same, dude. Um, Harrier pants. Oh, those are sort of cool. Oh, okay, so that's it. Alright, so that's pretty good. All right, let's go check all the goodies out. Well, there's my Santa hat. I already had that. There's a, that Ranger hat. There's your beanie. There's that. I don't know how in the hell I got my Santa hat, but that's cool. I'm not going to complain. Beanie and a riot hat. All right, cool. Two spares of glasses. We got those glasses, and we got those not too much difference one's uh, we got a scarf now no we don't need that got more mask gas mask that some crazy aviator thing that one and that one i think those are rewards from ubisoft the uplay rewards a hey, pacemaker Good evening to you there, young man. Wow, those are some, like some plethora of pants or something there, bro. Those aren't too bad. The Apex green. Those are actually sort of cool. We might rock those for a bit. So, my PlayStation's rocking, man, on my PC. So, having a good time here. Rolling through everything. Everything seems to be semi-working. No, everything's working fine. All right, so there we go. Oh, we got shoes too. Well, we zowie more boots, Sarge. Mm, no, I don't know. We got these already. Those are sort of cool. Where's your EMS? There's your EMS shoes. Yeah, they look like clogs. Is what they look like, sort of to me, Mr. Ortiz. Look like clogs. Yeah, clogs. Yeah, I'd say clogs. And weapon skins. <sighs> All right. Oh, the extra mission, the... What you do is, yeah, you shoot the rats, the four rats in the eyes, pacemaker, and that that one, it, it launches the extra boss after you kill all the bosses in the funhouse. That one? Or, or another one, pacemaker. Something more interesting, because I did do that mission the other day. It wasn't that, that much more. But I keep hearing about a hunter. And people said it's just the mask. It looks like a uh, Friday the 13th mask. 
But do you know something? Oh, they found another hunter mask in a tree trunk. Yeah, what they think that is is a um, Easter egg for the warlords of New York, is what they think. Since everybody everybody knows we're gonna get hunters over there, so they I believe that's what it's for, bro. I could be wrong, but I believe that's what it's for. Okay. All right, everyone. So, yeah. So as everybody knows, I'm on my PlayStation, but I'm actually on my PC uh, using the keyboard and mouse because Sarge can't rock with a controller, but I can F you guys up now. I can run with the best of you guys, man. You might have a hard time keeping up with me, to be honest. I might give you a run for your fucking money, honey. Mm, yeah, Sarge will love you a long time and, oh yeah. Uh, now, there's not too many tree trunks there, Epic, if you go look. You're talking about inside the fun house or outside? Yeah, inside the fun house right there. Correct. I forgot to show you, man. I am so sorry, um, Epic Wolf. I got so excited. The boss that you spawn isn't that big of a deal, Pacemaker. I don't know if you've killed him yet, but I did it in the video. It wasn't like, oh my god, this boss is like so hard to kill. Just to let you know. In case you haven't done it yet. I just, I'm just tripping that I'm actually using a keyboard and mouse. I mean, I'm just sitting here, like, playing just like I normally play. And I can alt-tab out of this right now and fire up my PC version, and it won't affect it at all. So I can literally switch between two games. I can play with people on PC and play with people on PlayStation at the same time. Because all this is using is bandwidth for the most part. Other than my streaming software. Supplies nearby. Yeah, it's like a total trip, man. <laughs> this is a total trip. I'm tripping, man. I'm tripping hard. It's like the whole thing is so cool. And it's only $6 for the software. Which makes it even better. So, I'm going to go ahead and buy it tonight because they give you a 14-day trial, but they only give you so many days to do all this extra mapping shit if you want to use a PC and all that crap like you're doing, like I'm doing, versus if you just want to use your controller on the PC or emulate a controller, whatever. I mean, there's so many. It Originally, the program started for people just to use a controller on the PC for games. That's what, and be able to remap them. That was the whole object of this, but then somebody figured out how to do this and they improved the software and made it so people like me that are dorks and can't figure out how to use a controller to save our ass um, can have the best of both worlds. Yeah, anybody who wants to help me, Pacemaker, can help me, man. With, you know, Mr. Ortiz, you. Agent requesting backup. Doesn't matter, man. As long as you guys don't get all stupid on the fucking missions. Because we have to do it in story mode. You know what I mean? So, the whole problem with story mode. See, I can, the, there's two ways you can do this. If you want to level up real fast, then I join you, Pacemaker, or Mr. Ortiz, or N7. And we run through a bunch of shit, right? In World Tier 5. The problem is then I'll have to come back and do all my stories. Does that make sense? But I can level up faster that way. See, so you have two options to do in this game. You can either spend a few days leveling up real fast, right? And then you got to go back and do all the fucking stories again. Because it doesn't count. 
unless you do it on story mode. See, if you can pick story mode, then it counts for me, I believe. Isn't that how it works, Pacemaker? But yeah, anybody wants to help me, Pacemaker, that's not a problem, bro. I'm game, man. That's the whole fucking reason I just spent $350 to buy this goddamn thing and get it all fucking set up, man. So, I didn't fucking do this shit so not to play. If I want to play by myself, I could just be on the PC. Man down. Yeah, so like I said, that's, you know, you guys want to help, that's not an issue. Yeah, because all I'm going to do is I'm going to do just like what you guys did. We're going to, uh, I'm just going to upgrade that settlement. So I got to do the Washington, the Jefferson, you know, do that, those first, right? And then go do, you know, all the other bullshit that you got to do. You know, go do the NASA and I just, yeah. Just, You're right next to the Grand Washington So, yeah, so. Okay, here we go. That should get their attention. Head to the service entrance on the east side of the building. Wow, sounds like somebody's all excited over here. But I did try to remap my drone to the right keys. Yeah, I see. I don't know why that number num two is shooting. That's bizarre. I shouldn't be doing that. So I still have a couple keys because to do my drone, I got to take my hand all the way over here on the other side of the keyboard, which I don't really want to do. So if I can get it to map correctly, then I'll be rocking. So that's one thing I'm going to do real quick here. That's what's cool. You can map on the fly. So it's a nice feature. So let's see if we can get this going correctly because right now I have to press my F1 key and that launches, that launches my drone right but I want to try to use my numpad to do that with so what you do is you go back out you hit your left wing key the windows icon key and that gives you control of your desktop again right okay then we're going to come over here and we're going to look See, I already have it set up, but that's not the right command, see? It's telling me it's that it's F, it's F1, F1 key. So that's F1 is L1, right? L1 and R1, correct? I don't think you can have duplicates. Yeah, see, that makes sense. Well, what you'll do is when you see me, Pacemaker, if I'm streaming, just hit me up and I'll jump onto your game. Because I can just, since I'm actually running the PlayStation software, I can just go to the, you know, go out of the game real quick and then just join, jump, some, jump in somebody else's game. You know what I mean? How it works, all that crap. See if I'm not playing at the time. That makes sense. Okay, so F1 is the one I want to have. 
Uh, I gotta, well, let me figure this part out here. Okay, that's L1, but I want L1 to be numpad four. Oh, I see where I got it wrong. Numpad four is R R one, which I don't want. I want L1. All right. So numpad four, I want L1. Not R1. Okay, then you click on apply. That's your skills. Okay, then you click on apply, right? Okay, then we go back in the game, right? Okay, now in theory, I should be able to press F4, I mean, numpad four, there you go. Launches my drone, numpad four. I think just like I had on my PC already, perfect. And when I got my other skill, that'll be numpad two. Now reload, I usually have my reload as the um, number, but it's okay, I got reload for the enter key. So yeah, so as long as I can move everything from the left side of the keyboard and keep it on the right side of the keyboard, it'll be perfect for lefties. So all us lefties can play together. And again, this way it's mimicking everything I already have. So this way I'm not like having to learn new keys, right? I can press exactly the same keys that I'm already pressing on the PC. So that makes my life a hell of a lot easier. And now see, I just have to undo that. Like when you move, you can leave cover shit. I have to change that setting, which is over here. Cause that's like a fucking crazy setting. That's that's like useless. Oh no, we want to turn the head tutorials off. Here you go, controls. Okay, so that's already turned on. See my grenade keys work. I mean, everything works as they're supposed to work. Now I get my scrolly working to change my weapons. I've got him in my sight. Once you're inside, find a way to the atrium. Because that's the only thing they don't have right now is your scroll. Your center mouse, they don't have to scroll. Which will rock, because then I can flip through my weapons faster, but I'm gonna set that up too, so that's not a problem. 
But again, I'm just jazzed that it's all working. Portable electronic device detected. Oh yeah, let's kill him. Let's kill this asshole. Okay, now you gotta make sure when you do this. I'm looking for the portable fucking electronic device that I might have just missed. Over here somewhere it says. Where? I think it's outside here, hold on. that I'll we'll have to wait maybe it's inside do a quick restock here So what you want to make sure you do is, see this guy over here in the hallway? You want to make sure you come over here because he's got a key, All right? So if you don't search this guy, you don't get the key. You don't get to open up the secret room, all right? You know about this, Mr. Ortiz, I think for watching my streams maybe enough, or Pacemaker or Epic Wolf. You guys don't know about this. Yeah, I couldn't believe that rat boss, man. Everybody's like, yeah, man, you, you, there's a secret boss, and oh, you, it's so hard to kill him and shit. I'm like, really? I could smoke that. We smoked him in, what, two grenades, and he was dead. And I was like, okay. Yes, yeah, so that's suite number three. So you guys make sure you get that card, because once you get past here, you can't come back and get it, and you'll be, like, all crying. Like, oh, what happened? Sarge was telling me there's some cards somewhere, but I don't know, man. I was doing shit at the time. Didn't pay attention. Bad boys. Bad boys. But, yeah, we're rocking it on the PlayStation. So, I didn't lose money spending that 300 bucks, man. And I have all those games to sell off, too. If anybody wants to buy some games, I got a shitload of them to sell. I want to sell them. I don't need them. That's for sure. Oh, I remember this part, man. This is the part that has all those dudes up there. Yep, I remember where I'm at now. I remember. Agent in need of backup. That, well, what, what it is, is that opens up a suite and there's special rewards in there. There's a couple weapon cases in there and shit. Suite number three. You can get that every time, but you only get the special weapons case. There's two weapon cases in there. You'll notice when you go in there, there are two different colors. So you only get the one the first time. After that, you just get regular weapons. 
So that's the whole schmeal behind that. Oh, I'm so glad my drone works normal. Look, I might have mods I can put on this weapon. Cool. Was that good for you guys? It was good for me. You go, hell man, he just like most. I just mowed them little bitches down. Electronic device detected. Yeah, mowed them bitches down, man. Oh yeah, she's like, she's waiting for dinner, man. She's looking, going, well, are you sure? She look, she's like, that's what she's waiting. She's like, oh no, man, we got it coming. Don't tell me, lady. I can, I, I can see it. Look at her, look at her, look at that. You go, well, where is it at? Bring it on, man. You can break on that good stuff. Not that crazy cat food. That's why, so you can tell her, see? That's why she's buttering me up. You gotta butter him up, man. He's getting chicken. Fuck that canned food. Oh, yeah. She's sitting right on my lap, man. It's like trying to be all that like, cool. Oh, yeah. Come on, where's that portable electronic device, man? Seriously. It's right here somewhere. Get it, Sarge. It says it's right here. Picking these things up. You must be on another floor. Well, there is some special ammo down here you can get. Right here. That's how you exit the mission. Mm, shit's over in the kitchen area. This is the area, the area people forget to come into and check. They go, I didn't even know there was an area over there. What? Yep. The area that you came through. You came from laundry. But you're gonna fall back over here when you get done with this because they're gonna have a minigun and you gotta fight these guys. So 
So this is the area you're gonna come back into to fight them from over here. At the end of this mission, when you have to come back down, there'll be a minigun over here. You just have to shoot a bunch of, see that minigun? The one they were shooting you with? You don't have to shoot everybody with that. So usually I go over there. All right, let's carry on with our shit. Our chitzels. Now, you don't have keys right now, but if you have keys, you can open up the hyena box, and that's where you're going to get your parts for your chatterbox. You're going to be coming out of that. Just to let you know. Oh yeah, it's up here. I'll show you where the suite is. I'm not there yet. I'll show you when I get there, bro. that part and there's special ammo up here whoops so again you want to rock some special ammo it's over here I know it's here somewhere in this room 
thought there was some in here. See if I can do some mods on my weapons. I got more weapons. I'm gonna switch that 45 APC on my for my secondary weapon. Alright. Ah, here we go, mod. Okay. Well, there you go. So I ain't modding shit yet. Yeah, we got more shit to sell though. That's cool. There we go. We're still rocking it. Onward, soldiers. To the fray. Detonate it and do it. Detonate that shit. I can't wait to do the hunters, man. The hunters are going to be so much fun. Bitches. Oh, that was fun. Alright. Yeah, we're getting there now, bro. We're, we're headed that way, man. to find the sweets up here. After this area, these are sweet one, see? You're looking for sweet three. Which is the next area over here. for my um, drone to come back up. There we go.
crazy YouTuber from Agent Crazy YouTuber. Uh, where these guys at? Oh, come on, bitches. Seriously. I just single, same fire in a single shot. Shouldn't be firing in like double, like double fire. Shouldn't be having an issue with my firing mode, right? So it doesn't seem to be firing on full auto. Okay, so when you get over here, to the suite number two, right? All right, this thing should be fire on full fucking auto. Must not have a key set up right for something. Oh yeah, there it goes. Alright, so it's working, okay. Go. Alright, so go through here. We gotta go to suite number three. We're not there yet. Alright, come here. See, suite number two. Four. Right around the corner. I'm on the roof, holding for backup. I have eyes on you, Kelso. You see Saint? I don't know what he looks like, but there are plenty of hostiles up there. Not for long. See, suite number three is upstairs here. Sweet number three, right down this hallway. All right, come right over here. See, sweets one through ten. Sweet three. This is where you interact with that key that you got off the dude's body in the laundry room. Now, if you notice, 
See the color of the box? That one's green. See, now next time you come in here, that one won't be there. There'll be like a regular box. You know what I mean? You won't be able to interact with it. So. But yeah, you only get this if you, the for one time, then after this, you won't get anything out of here again. That's, that's it. It's like a one, one shot deal. But it's cool though. It works. Uh, backpack. So the only thing we still haven't got is a mask. Which is like crazy. You know, all the other shit we've gotten so far, we haven't got a mask. Mr. Chambers. Oh, you have your lead up to 27? Yeah, but once you hit 30, Mr. Chambers, you'll be rocking, bro. I mean, so that's how you get into suite number three, everyone. All right. So what's our situation? Give it to me straight. I don't want any of this mail. You gotta get the key off the guy in the laundry area down there where they're doing the chem lab. Mr. President, it's And if it's you bad. don't, you're screwed. Whoever planned this timed it perfectly. We've already got outbreaks in 22 cities domestically and 14 internationally. Yeah, I gotta or change this key outbreak. from one Negative that I changed my weapons to DCD something over here on my numpad. So that's too far to reach across. No I'm like effing up constantly. I'm gonna change, I'm gonna swap it over so to my um Moscow. plus key. They've got problems with their Real radar. quick. The truth is we don't know. We just don't know. Uh, let me see what we got here. Hold on. Number one. Where's number one? Here we go. Number one. Yeah, I think I'm going to change that to my plus on my numpad. Yes, please. See, numpad, numpad plus. Cool. And you click on save again. Click on apply. And then go back into the game. Cool. All right, so we pop this drone real quick. Let's come back. And there you go. Now I can just hit my num key, my plus, instead of reaching all the way across my keyboard to change my weapons up. Why it doesn't want to go to my pistol, I don't know, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. Well, yeah, just don't bite off more than you can chew, bro. Know what I mean? You know, like, take your time. Does that make sense? You know, just do, just keep doing the missions, and eventually you'll have to go back. Do everything on story just to level up. If you do everything on story mode, you'll level up. Or hang out with somebody with a higher... Excuse me, a higher level, and they'll level you up real quick. And then you go back and do all your shit on story mode. Or they, if they're a higher level and they want to run it on story mode, they can run it on story mode so you get credit. But you got to run it on story mode the first time, and you're not going to get credit, and you got to go back and do it again. And then you're going to be upset. So, now see again, when you get hyena keys, there's two hyena boxes, one downstairs, one here, and they both have parts for the chatter box in here, possibly. <laughs> okay? That's how that works. Now, before I go up here, I'm going to eat my dinner. I got my dinner sitting here. Yeah, it's a whole different play style. Playing the Division is a whole different play style than doing the Wildlands and doing other games. You know, in one sense, you got to be... You got to sort of figure out where you're going to approach and where you got to post up and all that. That's like very important in this game. It's a matter of, you know, how you do shit. So. But I know you guys can do it, man. There's no doubt in my mind. 
I can do this shit. You can do this shit. I'm just glad that I got it working on the PlayStation so I can hang out with you guys. And girls. I mean, I say guys, I mean everybody, men, women and men both. What I think you understand. You start getting more of that stuff at level 30 after you unlock the main game. Like, you can, you, when you upgrade the White House and all that shit, and bring Ayaya over there. That's a mod lady. So the faster you upgrade the settlement and the faster you upgrade the White House, the faster you get your shit. Now, I will show you how to cheese the DZ when we get ready to do the dark zone. Oh my God, it's so cool. When we get ready to do this first dark zone here, I'm going to show you. You haven't done this yet, right? Hey, Kelly Cleveland, man. Joseph. Uh, did I read your message a few days back? You might have to refresh me, Kelly. Sorry. Joseph, how are you doing tonight there, young man? All right, so when we do this, I'm going to do this as fast as possible, right? So as fast as I do the settlement and I go back and it tells me I can go over here. What you do is when you get ready to leave, there's going to be three NPCs at the gate. If you only kill two of them and let the third one kill you, it puts you back a couple hundred meters and then you have to come up and do it again. Well, if you continually do that for a couple hours, you'll level up. Your DZ level will just go up and up and up and up and up. So you can level all the way up to 99 without even doing anything in the DZ at all, just by farming that thing over and over again. Who's man? Good evening, man. So when I get to that point, I'm going to show you guys how to do that. It only works on the first DZ. It doesn't work on number two and number three. So you got to do it on this first one. You get your score all the way up to 99. This way, when you go over there and do shit, you'll be a higher score already. And so you'll get higher gear and shit, right? Does that make sense? So Usman, Usman, I have my um, my PlayStation. I have it running on my PC. I'm able to use my keyboard and mouse, microphone. I mean, I can do everything just like I'm on a PC. But I'm playing on a PlayStation. So that's rocking. Hmm. But how you guys doing today? Oh, come on, get down, man. Come on. This is like ridiculous, man. 
I'm trying to eat my dinner and I'm supposed to feed you guys? I gotta feed me first. I worked hard, man, to get my PS4 working. That's been running great, bro. All day. I'm just, uh, as soon as I finish my dinner, I'll go to the last part of this mission. But yeah, it runs great. No problem at all. Just how all my cats are just like hanging out, wanting my chicken, as usual, right? Hell, man. Get down there and steal your cat food, so you guys like it. You want to bring that over here first? Are you referring to that article right there, William? And welcome, by the way. The subject was about your rig being stolen from your dad, which he's an ex-Ranger drill sergeant. Kelly, I don't remember that conversation at all, man. That I definitely would have remembered. So, or I'm sorry, but no, I don't remember that. But do you have anything to elaborate on your story? Any good news? That we can share with you or you can share with us? Oh, I'm telling you, Usman, man, they're like all on my shit, man. Do you think I had fish cologne on or something right now? You know what I mean? I'm like, back off. Gary, good evening, man. I'm telling you, man, it's like I have fish fucking cologne on, bro. No, good. No, come on. Holy shit. Go. Go. 
Hilarious. To be on honest, Kelly, I don't know how to do that, but you know what I mean? I have to like try to look on the other video and it's hard to follow people's live comments. So go ahead and eat. And when you come back, you can go ahead and tell us the story. Sorry. Sorry to say, man. But we're going to be here for a while, so go ahead and go eat. Go ahead and have you get dinner in you and go relax. I'm eating right now, so go ahead and chow down, man. It's no big deal. I'm not going anywhere. Down, down. Hmm. We are getting there. Oh, no offense taken, ma'am. We know you're not directing your comments at anybody. We're always talking about bitches and hoes. Mostly referring to Ubisoft. way too much food. See, I don't know why she tried to feed me so much. That crazy. I'll be right back. Move.
nothing for you. See? Yeah, I gotta vacate, leave me alone. Stop doing the beggar the beggar kitty kitty routine. The little buggers. <sighs> oh my god. Alright. Awesome, Eddie. Yep. That's what I paid, bro. I paid $2.99, so I can put happy faces on the wall for you guys, see? Sarge's got a happy face on the wall, man. $2.99. What more can I say? Happy face. Happy face time. $2.99. Yeah, once I figure out how to walk and all that shit, I'll be cool. My guy doesn't want to walk right now. He's still doing the uh, running thingy. I don't want him to do. Yeah, see, so once I once I figure out how to get him walking, but it's okay. We got happy pace. Gary, what do you mean what happened with the game? I don't know what happened with the game, man. Now you're scaring me. Huh? Well, this would be a scary guy, huh? There you go. Scary guy. <laughs> well, broke point is broken. Broke point is broken, Gary, so you might as well go back to the Wildlands, bro. Because broke point is hasta la vista for a while. Hey, there you go. Nice. Nice splinter, nice splintery guy on the door there. That's pretty cool. Even looks splintery, man. It's got that nice splintery look to the wood. I like it. I like my artwork, man. That's right, three bucks. You can make happy faces all over the map for three bucks. Base maker, I will see you on Wednesday, sir. The date. Dream Queen, boo yourself there, young lady. Well, here you go, Dream Queen. I'm playing playing on the PlayStation. It's all for you, man. You're the one who started this whole thing. You got to take responsibility, right? You're the one who said, Sarge, why don't you have a PlayStation? Then we can play together, all right? But I hope you had a good day at work. We won't talk about that right now. Talk about you. Hope you had a good day at work. Hope you're all rested and settled. Um, but everything's working fine. You see, I got my keyboard. I got my mouse. I mean, I can do like, just like I'm on PC. Everything for the most part. A couple keys I still have to map. But for the most part, you're actually looking at me on the PlayStation on my PC. If that makes sense. Oh, Gary, I'm doing the very first mission, man. Odessa Sawyer rescuing her daughter. Yeah, so I'm actually playing like in a windowed... I'm playing on the PlayStation, but via my PC. Keyboard and mouse, microphone. So it's really cool because I can switch between the two. I can play this and then just jump on Division 2 at the same time. So, so there you go. So, and you have the division two, so we can at least play this together. And we're both starting out together because I'm doing the first mission. 
So if you get time tonight and you want to play, we can hang out because it's still early. Because I'm barely do. I just started just now, Dream Queen. So I'm doing our doing the first mission, that Odessa mission, this one. So I'm literally level two. And you said you just downloaded it and you're just starting. So that means we can just play together. Right? Everybody else, everybody else is higher level. I think um, Mr. Ortiz, it's Tommy. I think he's up in the 20s, I believe. I think N7 Wild one seventeen. I hate to think what Cecily Mia is, but they're probably up there. Well, that's why I said I'll show you. It's a real easy game to play. So, like I said, I, you know I already leveled up with my other division character, right? So, like I said, you know, if you got time, if you've already eaten dinner and you got your chores done and you want to fire up your PlayStation, you can come and join me. And then, like I said, we'll just keep, I'll, I'll walk you through everything. And that way you get the hang of what's going on. It's real easy. It's a fun game to play because it looks really good. And DC is really cool to run around and shit too. Well, no, that's why I said take your time. I just got done eating. So take your time, shower, eat. I'm not, I'm going to be playing for several hours. It's only 730. I'm going to try to play till midnight or something for like five, six hours. Because I want to level my guy up. We got to level up. Because everybody else is way in front of us, man. And then what we'll do over the next couple days is we'll play with people at their level. And as long as they do it on story mode, we'll get credit for that mission. See, if they do it on normal or hard or something, then we got to go back and do it again. But if, if they let us do the same missions we have to do, then we'll, then we'll level up real fast. If we're with somebody that's like gear 400, you know, world tier 5. So that'll help all of us really help you and I real good. But yep, go do your thing. I'm gonna use the head real quick, everybody. I'll be right back.
So, uh, we got planned here. Joseph, the playing Warframe, right? It play attack to my frame because the uh, ability I'm using to slow them down less casualties, but oh well, whatever, man. Oh yeah, that's fine, Dream Queen. Sorry, but he was using the same ability, he made me much faster and kill him as an idiot. Oh, uh, I see what you're saying, Joseph. Well, yep, that's what happens sometimes. People talk all that smack to you, and they end up getting their asses kicked. Yep, that happens. I've seen that shit happen. Apparently, I got some more apparel here. Let's see what we got. Shoes. More shoes. Game loves clothes in this game. Oh, there are these over here. These are new ones. Yeah, so we have to get Grace Larson. Once I do her, then I can do my clans. But yeah, Joseph, that's, you know, I see that shit all the time in games, bro. So again, the next thing that we're working on here, which we were trying last night, I want to thank everyone that helped out late trying to get, uh, somehow I can do what I'm doing instead of on YouTube I can broadcast on Twitch stream on Twitch which means I can play music then in the background right because there won't be no restrictions on that shit so that's what we're trying to figure out how to do now but because I, I bought that turbo boost package for, for Discord it's like $10 a month and it allows you to do all that crap so that's the next thing we're going to be doing is we'll be figuring out how to stream. So what will happen is you guys will be able to go into the room that we're streaming from. And if you have microphones and all that shit or whatever, if you can chat, then you'll be able to verbally chat instead of just typing in the chat box. So that'll be even better for people that can, you know, that have mics. You guys can chirp into the conversation. So we're going to take it to the next level here. But yeah, we were trying that last night till fuck, man, late. It's like 2.30 in the morning, man. I couldn't get it to work right. I got part of it to work. got the audio to work, but I couldn't get the video to work. So, but like I said, I got this working. So I know if I can get this working. This is harder to do than that, I think. It's just, this. these companies, man, it's like, the way that they do their programs, they just sort of assume that we all know a whole bunch of shit. You know what I mean, sometimes, which is ludicrous because that's like the whole assumption is on them. Like, see, this company that I'm dealing with with this software, they just figure everybody knows how to use a controller. And that's why I was telling them, well, no, you got to you got to realize there's people who want to use a PlayStation to play with other players or they like games or whatever. You know, sometimes they have exclusives, right, for PlayStation. But they want to be able to do it on a PC because we don't use a keyboard. We want to use a keyboard and mouse, not a controller. I said, so the fact that you guys are just assuming that when I look at a triangle and a square and a circle and an X and a D up and D left and D right, that I'm going to know what all that shit means. See, and I told them that's not necessarily true for people that don't use those. So that's, you know, yeah, so I said for them, if they could make it even easier and have like a basic one done, you know, which they basically do, as soon as you go in there, they, they really have one that's already set up already. It's just, you know, so I know the software is only going to get better. But they really need to work on more configs, like basic configs. Because there's so many games out there that are the same. Like Division 1 and Division 2 are pretty close, right? For what we do. So, you know, so I think there's a lot of games where they could just have a default 
setting and what you do is you go in there and you have a drop down menu and you pick that game then if you want to tweak any of the keys a little bit then you can go in there and tweak stuff right that was my suggestion to them and to have a better video where people actually talk they have like a five minute video with elevator music which is annoying as fuck, and then they go really super fast. You know, it's like they just jam through this fucking video. I'm like, dudes, can you, like, slow down a little bit? Like, what's wrong with having a 10-minute tutorial, right? Like, are you, like, speed running on tutorials today? Yeah, I wasn't very happy. But little by little, like I said, I'll get all the keys mapped. When I have everything mapped pretty good, then we'll go ahead and throw this up on their site for people to copy. Like, see, like, some of these things, like I said, I got to make sure that um, toggle GPS, right? That's normally our G key, right? And then like missions is like, you know, it's, you know, there's certain keys that already you already have set up there that, that Ubisoft has default. So that's what I want to do is try to mimic all those as close as possible. Oh my God, cats, man, just relax. Hey, 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 come here. Stop picking on all the cats. Man, well, you got an attitude. Holy cow. Look at one cat's got a total freaking attitude, man. I'm still here. Sorry. You know me. I'm here, folks. I've not gone away. <sighs> Just finished up with my meal. Smoking my apertipi. My apertipi. So, yeah. So, like I said, what I'm going to do is, as soon as I can get over to the DZ and do that first DZ and then I'll roll through there and show you guys how to level that guy up to 99 before you even unlock any other DZ
I will show you, Miss Dios. But first, ah, Easter eggs. Okay, Red Dead Redemption 2. Paycheck comes out, spoiling a Big Mac, finding Easter eggs. Go, hold up. What? Hold on. How in the hell are you going to buy the game from finding Easter eggs or gold, bro? You've lost me, dog. You can't use, like, eggs and Easter eggs and gold in the game to buy it. You've lost me, Joseph. You and your tr your crazy translation sometimes. You've lost me there, son. Red Dead Redemption 2. We got that, man. We're tracking that part of the whole conversation, bro. Where you've lost Sarge and maybe other people here is how in the hell your paycheck comes, right? And then you're going to explore. Oh, I see. You're going to buy it when your paycheck comes. Then you're going to explore the big map to find Easter eggs or gold. Gotcha. Well, you know I did videos on that. Man, I got to go in and edit my playlist. I got so many goddamn videos that I didn't put in playlist yet. Holy shit. <sighs> no biggie. Don't don't sweat the small stuff, man. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. But yeah, if you haven't heard good news, oh Thomas Lee Dunkley, man, don't worry about being late, dog. You're never late to the party, man. We're rocking it. Just had our dinner. Getting ready to do this mission. Um, we're having a good time. It's raining. Yeah, nice. Sounds good. Down till real freaks out my cat. Well, I know it's late there, bro. I know you're five hours ahead of me. Five hours ahead of us. They actually have the weather rocking. See, this is what I understand. Why didn't they make breakpoint with the snowdrop engine? The snowdrop engine, that's the first thing they did wasn't wrong with breakpoint. Because they should have used this engine right here. That actually works. I mean, the weather looks good, right? Clouds look good. <coughs> Everything looks good. No, instead, they use that fucking crappy ass fucking engine. That's like old as shit. That makes Breakpoint look like shit. This is why I'm not worried about buying it on the PlayStation. PlayStation, I'll, if anything, I'll get Warlords of New York for the PlayStation. I think I'm smoking too much. I am Gary. Calm down there, son. Sarge is gonna game there, son. I'm gonna game, Gary. Okay. Donate, Gary. Donate.
me, me. Don't me, me, me. No. Donate. Donate, Gary. Gary, donate. Huh. Tell him. Tell him. Tell him, huh, honey. Don't get to the key, bud. Glad you made it. Huh. Huh. Yeah. Let's do this. Let's do it, baby. Let's do it like they do it on the animal planet. On the Discovery Channel. What do they say? Let's do it like the animals do it on the Discovery Channel. Sounds good to me. Let's do it. Rain or shine. Agents deliver. Ready? Let's do it, baby. I'll take the first kill. Damn, I got a miss bar. Got a miss bar, man. Oh, hell yeah. Wow. Bitch. Yeah, Fiat. Oh, get some, baby. Yeah. They tried kicking you offline, bro. Oh my god. A bunch of pussies. Cecily Mia got reported for like using foul language on a player. So she got reported, got a warning. I was like, oh my god. A bunch of fucking pussies, man. Sarge wouldn't last one day, man. On a pub server on the PlayStation Network. Oh no. Their little fucking panties would be all up in a fucking bunch, man. You just see it now. I can see it now. Well, you're a lucky little fucker, huh? Yeah, all over the place, though. Bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? Oh, what you gonna do when they come for you? Bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? 40 hours a week, baby. Bad boys, bad boys. Yeah, man. We be the bad boys, man. The bad boys, man. And we are going to F you up, bitches. That's like hardcore, huh? It's all up in your grill. Sorry to play a conservative, man.
fucking way you're out of ammo, dude. Could get some ammo. Be stock, soldier. It's no excuse. Can't fight, I ain't got no ammo, sir. Oh, hell no, man. That shit ain't flying there, soldier. You will find ammo. Hey, 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 that's my kill, lady. Back off. Back off, bitch. Fuck. You motherfuckers, man. Steal my shit, man. Steal my thunder. Taking my mojo. Alright, let's go get her, man. Let's go get the girl. The young girl. Let's go do this, man. Eleanor? Eleanor Rigsby. That's not Eleanor Rigsby. God damn it, I thought we were doing a Beatles song. Who are you? Who are you? What's going on? What's going on? <laughs> I'll bring her down. Oh my god, I had a bad trip, man. Uh, I took that X and I don't know what happened, man. I was in the club raving and shit, and next thing I know, it was all fucked up, and people were getting all freaky deaky on me. And Heads up, you've got hostiles flooding in. There's like the hands everywhere. Get and down there and take care of them. I got Eleanor. <laughs> I felt, I felt violated in all sorts of places. Uh-huh. Oh yeah, violated for sure. That's all I can say, dude. It was like total violation time. You should have been there. It was crazy. Yep, it was violation time. They had me everywhere. They had me coming and going and going and coming. It was crazy. <laughs> oh, I already said that. Okay, well it was crazy some more. Let me tell you. I will tell you that. A bit slap him, man. I did. I meleeed him. My melee key is working, folks. Agent in need of backup. Oh, man. I'm in need of backup, dude. I need a fucking reach around, man. That's what I need, soldiers. Backup, reach around, the whole nine yards, man. Yep. I need to have a Calgon bath. I need to, like, say, Calgon, take me away. One of those moments, right? Call that elevator, Sarge. Thank you very much, Gary. I'm glad you're counting all those shots there, sir. What can I say? Oh, yeah, I know. To get her laughing. Yeah, yeah, I guess I'm gonna get a laugh out of her now. She's gonna see that. All right. This music is like I never noticed this music before. I can honestly say that. Whoa, whoa, slow your roll, soldier. That's so you can close that elevator door on Sarge. God damn it! I'm fucked now. Teamwork? What teamwork, man? Oh, with me and my, my girl? Me and my shadow? Yeah. Okay, well, yeah, we got teamwork there, bro. We got thing that's called... A thing called love, man. You know what I mean? Whoa, whoa, slowly roll, soldier. Get back over there. That's not what I wanted you to do. I want to turn your frickin' dumb to your thingy on there. Because lost his mind.
Yes, yeah, ours does it backwards, man. Oh, baby, okay. rock it. Easy peasy, soldiers. Easy peasy. Somehow I missed a collectible in here, man. I don't know how I did it, but I missed a collectible. Balls. Yeah. I'm to get it next time, maybe. Next time we do this. We have to do this on hard, anyways. Yeah, some I miss a collectible here. Guarantee you. It's the one I'm thinking. Well, how do I zoom in? Uh huh. Oh, I can't zoom. Oh, well, that's not good. Hmm. Yeah, I gotta be able to zoom on my map. Uh huh. Well, so that could be a problem right there, huh? Because on PC we can zoom in. So how do you guys zoom in on your map? Right now I'm playing solo, Gary. Yep, I will be playing with somebody here in a few minutes. As soon as they get done eating and taking a shower, we'll be rocking. I'll be hanging out pretty soon. They're not online yet. Oh, now my microphone might be an issue, though. I just noticed something there. Oh, no. It didn't say mute. Well, I guess not. All right. I guess that won't be a problem. Oh, I finally got a better mask. It's about freaking time. Well, let me recognize this other one, though. All right. And back. back. Nope. Chest piece, whoops. So, so far, oh, we got a cache though. Might as well open up our cache. Nice. We've got another ACR. So that's good. Let's see what we got for a gear piece here. Nope, lower. Then we can go back to the vendor and sell all this shit. See what see what good stuff they have. Oops, I forgot. Where's that ACR I just got? This one. Alright. Yeah, so somehow I missed some, some collectibles, but we just have to get them next time. Because I can see them on the map, I just can't. I might be able to go back. Let me see if I can go back. I don't know where it's at, though. But I can see it. Let's see if I can go back. I don't think I can. I 
Oh. No, we'll get it next time. Next time around, man. dark outside. I can't see shit out there, man. Holy shit balls. Alright, so now uh, we go back over here. Fast travel is what? Oh, this. There we go. Alright, go back to the settlement. Chit chat with what's her name there? Odessia. Unlock our shit. There yourself there, partner. All right. It's worse than ever, Odessa. We're barely holding things together. What am I no, supposed to do? Help us. I am helping. I am helping. Oh my God. Just not the way you want me to. We need yeah. you out there again. Your leg wouldn't stop you. It's not about that. I know it isn't. But if we fail... All right! All right. We could probably spare some people. Probably spare some I'll people? Be outside. That's it. That sucks, but man. <laughs> Donate a diet coke, part. Gary. You rock, dog. I won't forget Thanks it. Thanks so much for the diet coke offer, man. Very nice, man. All right, she's a happy lady. We're happy. Well, she's semi-happy. Oh, next year you're going to get a PC? Sounds like a good plan there, Thomas Lee. Missions, Jefferson, Viewpoint, American. Da -da -da. Right. Did we get anything yet? Where's our where's that bender lady at? Where's that bender bitch. Hello there yourself there, stud muffin. Yeah, where's she at? She's over here somewhere. And there's her stash, we won't need that. 
Alright, here she is. Hate to ease that little girl. That bender girl. That doesn't even do as much damage as our um, M16. Piece of doo doo, man. Ready to make dude. A deal? Yeah, let's make a deal, man. Sounds like, a per sounds like the plan. Hold on. Oh, shit balls. Okay, well, that'll work. I can live with that. Okay, so, no, we're not going to sell that. We can sell this other crap that we don't need. My inventory could use this. Good. I needed that. Thanks. Exactly what I needed. Me too. More money, bro. I needed that. Yeah. Thanks. All right, you're welcome. Buy and equip. Sounds like a deal. Enjoy your new purchase, Agent. Yes, sir. I sure will. Nice doing business with you. Nice doing business with you, too, Stud Muffin. Alright, so what are we going to do? Let's go knock some shit out here, level up. I guess we're going to go do that one, huh? Looks like it. Looks like we're. It looks like we're going. Yeah, see, we're stuck on the story mode right now. That's okay. All right, yep, that's where we're going. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Slow your roll, soldier. Yep, that's where we're headed. Oh, hell yeah, man. You're going to get a dog this year? He's going to get a PC this year? You guys rock, man. Fucking dark in this game, huh? Mm, yeah. It's so effing dark. Could be like bad guys everywhere. All these shit balls. So we lost their mind. Yeah, just go ahead, dude. Go out there. It's not that dark. Yeah, it is. It's dark as a mopo. I mean, it's not that dark. It's fucking dark to me. Yeah, I'm thinking of opening a brothel this year, man. Yep. Echo, nearby. Full service brothel. Mm -hmm. Everything. Just become daytime? Seriously. Why are you tormenting me like this? You make me run around here in the fucking dark. 
I can't see shit. quick here before I get my ass kicked. There might be an ass kicking mode on me. Uh, let me see what's going on over here. Oh, no, me either. It's darker than darkness. Yeah, the sun's coming out, man. It doesn't stay dark for very long. Only like four hours or some shit in the game. And it starts getting light. Thank God.
All right, that was fun. Of course, you know, you gotta get that loot, right? The more loot you get, the faster you level up. Sell that shit, get better gear. Cool, that was fun. Jefferson died. Last radio contact with Espinoza came from a parking garage close to the shade node. Isaac has the location. See, we don't have any mods yet, so that's the sucky part. It's all good. Oh, we've got another feral key. Oh, yeah. All right, let's open this puppy up. DC PD boots. All right, go. Cool. All right, we got DC PD boots. Yaha. All right, gotta go look at them or else that stupid thing will be there forever. There you go. All right. Super excited. Yep.
Oh, hell yeah, Thomas Lee. Cool, man. Good man. Oh yeah, it's not over yet. It just started. into the wall. Or is that my door friend? One or the other.
right onto our next area. Our next adventure area. Hostile radio intercepted. We're under attack! Intruders at the east entrance! Then kill them! What the fuck? It's a division! Calm down, lady. So? Fucking kill them! Calm down. Look for a way down to the garage and see if you can pick Calm up down. Espinosa's That's trail. Nothing. He tends to leave a mess. Yeah, whatever, lady. Sounds like he needs a diaper. Stand up. Come on, dudes. Man, you guys are like. Can you go and just not like. Neutralized. Portable device detected. Hold on, hold on, hold on there. Okay, so where do we stand? Basically, hold everybody on. outside about a 50 mile radius of DC is completely cut off from the network. Completely. What do we do about it? First, we need to assess the full scope of the damage. Mm -hmm. Which means quite places that won't be easy yeah. to get to. Because they're in hostile territory. It's not just nope, that. They got the did a lot of damage. Let me see one more guys. Of our you think it was flooding that caused the network to go down? Not a chance. This was deliberate.
Shade nodes. So I can operate. Please, we can operate. Authorization granted. Yes. Please stand by. Intelligent system analytic computer reactivated. All Isaac subsystems operational. That was the last step to getting Isaac fully restored locally. But we have a ways to go before we can celebrate. And a missing agent to locate. Continue your sweep of the complex. Yes, ma'am. Sweep of the complex. Hostile radio intercepted. Hello? Is Yo. this the division? Yes, bitch. Looking for someone? No, bitch. Who is this? How are you on this channel? Looking Friend for love in all nice the wrong places. Watch. Looking He's for right love here. with too Wanna many faces. Where's the team? Maybe tomorrow there, bro. Mostly. They'll keep them alive. They Poor are stupid. Gary. Just find we them. We'll get our team together, babe. Oh, there. I finally got a better fucking mask. Oh, my God. Not freaking time. Yeah, don't worry, Gary. We'll, we'll get the team together, so. The team will be coming. May not be today. But it will be it will be here, sir.
Yeah, remember we got another group that comes. It's one of the first groups. Okay. Don't get all excited and say, oh yeah, that was easy. Okay, we got two two waves of these guys. One more wave. Forgot we get three waves. Three of the crazy waves. Yeah. What we've got on the table is a possible solution. What we've got is a possible sure. disaster. Possible we haven't solution, done nearly enough field testing on your solution. It's all the we same, don't even baby. know if it's toxic, for God's sake. What we do know is that people are dying, and this stuff kills the green poison. How many deaths do you want on your hands because we waited for tests to come back to tell us what we already mm. knew? He has another oh, key box right there once you get something. high hena keys. Now I could have gone the underground and got keys. I just didn't bother to do that yet. So you could just go farm keys right away in the subways. Hey guys, I'm still willing to deal, but you better decide so that's not a big deal. I don't know how this dude can take. She's goading you to try to make you reckless. Just stay sure. focused. Mm -hmm. Stay focused, there, dude. Focus, focus, focus.
Should be a couple waves in here, I think. Oh yeah, but if I remember correctly, it's like three waves over here, and then one upstairs, and. So long as I've done these missions. Almost forgot how to do them. Alright, we're getting there, folks. She Get your tunnel down signs. There. Zero. He didn't have to die here. Nope. And everybody wants to attack you. But you don't have to miss the way attack is. Yep.
do that. Trick is only open up one of these doors, don't open up both doors. Alright? This way you don't fuck up. If you open up one door, they can only come and get you one way. That makes sense. Excuse me. <coughs> oh, man, excuse me.
Booster Chambers. Oh, there you go. Now you're rocking it, bro. Almost got this pool. Got more shots. Pretty good. I do that shit, guys. That fucking hyena was toying with us. I hope she suffered a bit before you finished her off. Anyway, thanks to you, we're at the point step closer to the shade network back to full strength. Oh, yeah, level up. I'll see you around. Looks like Isaac's back up and running. Nice. Meet me back at the White House. I've got some new intel I want to share with you and Manny. That was good, man. Hey, agent. We're ready to help broaden your skill set over here at the base. Mm -hmm. Gotta broaden my skill sets at the base. I like that. to the White House, broaden our skill sets. Sounds like a deal, man. Bless you. Thanks, bro. Yeah, so your elite damage is 32. Power is almost 200. Turret melts. Good. Good, good, good. Excellent, dude. That's what I like to see. Yeah, you always want to get your healing drone and your turret burst. Those are the two most essential. After that, you want to play with all that shit? That's fine. That's not a problem. Agent, thanks to your hard work, we've been able to make some critical upgrades to the base of operations. Good. We've restored access. Great to hear that. Looks like you're ready to learn a new skill. What'll it be? Turret. Uh, Alright. Yeah. Sign that slot. There you go. Alright, now let's go to our perks. Cool. Two perks. Scopes. For sure, that's what I want. Mm. 
get my grips. Alright, so that's it. Goodbye. Goodbye, man. Till we meet again. Big selection. That's what I've got. Okay, it's funny. Alright, so we don't have anything in here. We don't have anything in there. Don't have anything there. Uh, don't have anything there. So we sell all that shit off. Cool. Alright, come over here. Vendor. Sell. What's his name up there? Is yeah, these are people who are glitching at this point. They couldn't do that part of the. If mission. I can't get more pieces from the toy store, I'm not going to be able to finish my fucking map. All right, Manny. Jeez. While the sheriff here was busy waking up Isaac, I kicked in a few doors. Did you learn anything? Some new cuss words. Anything useful? I know where we can find out where the cure was sent. The capital? We can't get past those defenses. Not yet. But once we reconnect to our satellite network and get the main shade node online, we should be back at full strength. Then we'll be ready. Okay, well in the meantime, we have Intel President Ellen survived the crash. He's being held by one of the factions. Locating him should be a priority. Oh, fuck that. There could be another major outbreak anytime soon. We don't need some politician. We need that cure. We might need him to access it. It'll be somewhere secure. <sighs> All right. Let's see what we can do. I don't know whether to be flattered or offended, Manny. Right, new missions. Hell yeah. We'll be rocking it. And you know, and there's a lot of radios and shit here at the White House that you can pick up here, see? They're like everywhere. So there's several, several of them with the White House you want to pick up. So no. all What's the latest? Here. Have you decided Russia's responsible after all? No. So I'm, probably, I'm not going to show you the dark zone, all that shit tonight, because it's not opening up yet. So we'll have to do that another day. It's no big deal. Don't worry about it. Okay, yeah, see, all this is starting to open up. But that's not a problem. Let's see. Yep, there's a few of them down here too that you're gonna pick up. See how they're starting to bust open the walls. See, this is where your little, this is where you can change your looks and appearances of eventually. Can't right now. Your shooting range is gonna be there, and operations over there, and but little by little, like I said, you'll find more and more collectibles. There's one over here in the president's office. You might as well go over here now. Pez's office. Let's get that one. There's one right here. Are you sure you want to do this? The yeah. optics are going to be terrible. Positive, With all due respect, Mr. Mendez, screw the optics. 
Manhattan's in a crisis state, and this is the one club I've got left in my bag. Hell if I'm not gonna take a swing. Nope. Agreed. Hopefully, this will only be needed for a short time, and we can deal with the fallout once the crisis is passed. And if it's not over quickly, what do we do then? Then yeah, you better learn some useful skills, because if this thing yeah, drags on, more outside. Goes. Thanks for taking my call. You want to make sure you I grab all these. Like there's, a, there's a few around the White House here, Scott. No, 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 you want to go grab. Not the time for pleasantries. So make you grab these. No, quick. we're no closer to finding a cure. Look, if we had anything, we'd be sharing it. I swear, Ellis. You ever get the feeling that there's something funny going on? There's yeah. nothing funny about funny, this yeah. situation, funny, Mr. Funny. President. Knock it off. You know what I mean. I'm nope. not sure that I do. Nope, it's just all of this I. feels harder than it should. Like there's something pushing mm -hmm. back against everything we're doing. You sit in the big office. There's always going to be people pushing back reflexively yep. on anything you do. Yeah, you right. know I've got your back. Oh, yeah. So does the country. Mm -hmm. So, sure. worry less about the hypothetical crisis. And let's deal there. with the real one we've got facing us right now. Can't go there. Alright, so see, like I said, there's a shitload of them around here, so. I'm going to grab all the ones you can grab. Thought there was one over here, but there's not. Alright. Oh, I think there's a couple the other direction too. Yep, there's one here, and I think there's a couple, like I said, on the other side. So they're scattered. Priority around here. message to all active duty agents: mm -hmm. Be aware that Agent Aaron Keener, call sign Vanguard, has had his agent status revoked and is now a priority target. Keener is directly responsible. Priority message to all active duty agents. The individual responsible for the creation and release of the smallpox variant of the Chimera virus, too, also known as the Dollar get. Flu or the Green Poison, has been identified as Dr. Plans. Gordon Amherst. Amherst's body has been found and identified. Postmortem shows that he died of his own disease. End message. Alright, we're rocking it. So there we go. We're doing it, agents. You're doing it. This will never do. Yeah, whatever, dude. It's so dark in here, man. Can you guys get some lights in here? It's so freaking dark in this place. Yeah. Got lights. Lights, folks. Unless it's supposed to talk to people and there's no lights anywhere. There you go. Alright, so that's it for the night. I'm going to stop here for a while. Oh, it's that, yeah, they, they got a pretty good dialogue going on. Everything. I have to admit, Mr. Chambers. Yeah, I didn't uh, realize that was a Knights one from um, For Honor, Joseph. Yeah, so I guess I'm going to stop for the night. And um, we'll continue our sojourn here on another adventure later. So, Joseph, Mr. Chambers. Gary, drink them Diet Colas there, Gary. Thomas Lee Dunkey, I know it's late for you, bro. Bro, Thanks for hanging out, Randinator. The late crowd, I get the late crowd tonight. Dream Queen, she's off doing something. Epic Wolf, awesome Eddie. And of course, Pacemaker was here earlier. Kelly Cleveland was around earlier. William Troop, Usman, Mohammed, thanks for coming by, as always, Mr. Usman. If I didn't say goodbye to you guys, oh yeah, it's Tommy, Mr. Ortiz, Shock Tube, Dan Tamblin, be around tomorrow again, he said, that's great. And Seven Wild One, 
He doesn't feel good, so he's probably sleeping. And Apollo Patriot. So if I didn't say hi to you, that doesn't mean I don't love you. It means I couldn't go far that far back in chat. Whatever. So until I see everyone tomorrow, as always, this is Sergeant Fury. It's been a pleasure doing this for you. Always remember, Eddie, soldiers.